you will be removed and sanctioned appropriately. You know, before we remove you without knowing where you are, this time around we will catch you before we remove you. Anything DOS says is what goes. Uzurumite is heading our reconciliation committee. If he calls you on the phone, you must listen to him and do as he says. He is our deputy head of directorate of state, led by Mazichike Dosiem. They are the highest decision making body in IPOB. If that thing is difficult, then I will say it to me. Do you understand? Anything they ask. If they call you on the phone, you don't return their call or your doing is from head. I would then believe that the zoo has brought you over and you'll be dealt with. The two states be warned. No doubling in volunteer affairs or ESN affairs in the state. ESN is in the state for information. And very soon work will commence there immensely. Work will commence. Work will. A those state comes under EKTB as the federal coordinator. We run a discipline movement more than anything. We value discipline more than anything else in the world. In IPO, that's the only thing we have. That is, that is we, that we are able to defeat the zoo and destroy the zoo is hinged on one thing, and that is discipline. If you know you cannot work for IPA, you get out and join the server. One day your judgment will come. We'll find those hiding in Kotonu, those are hiding somewhere near Apite, uh, near Swam, in, in, uh, in River State, we'll find all of you. You not in the water. I say River State because comprises upland and, and coastal region. We'll find all of you. Oh, in Bante, they still have a police checkpoint. Okay, okay, don't worry. Uh, don't worry, you, you'll hear the news very, very soon. You will hear it. I said, no police checkpoints in Jaffa Land. I said, no police checkpoint, I said. The ones in a bank, go and tell them, I said, no police. If your brother, your uncle, your sister, your cousin is there, tell the idiot to get away and dismantle that checkpoint or else they will die. There. No state coordinator is allowed. No state coordinator is allowed to contact the state commander no matter what. And as a commander, if you're removed, you're removed, you step aside, how others will do the job. We don't want a type of Biafra that will be like the zoo. If you lose election, you leak it, and you remain in power. When the age of retirement is 65, at the age of 85, you're still in power, that probably should not obtain. We are not like any other stupid sort of black people from Africa. We are Biafans. You must understand that. And follow others accordingly. My instructions to this global family is this. We have the DOS. We have the finance department. We have the legal department. And we have the medical. Anybody who is appointed into office, if you fail to obey your superior officer, you will be dismissed live on air. I will dismiss you myself. And as I said, as I'm, as I'm dismissing you, men are on the ground to apprehend you. You must obey your superiors. It is based on discipline, please. All this breaking, going forwards and backwards, I want to obey. That means you are not prepared to be in IPOB. If you don't know what obedience is, you shouldn't be here. After all, we are all on the oath. It doesn't matter if you were from, with me from the beginning or not. You must obey your superiors, please. Very, very important. Very, very important. There are also finance officers. You know, those schools that stole our money from Georgia, they think they're very smart. But uh, they'll go to jail and they understand it. If you are a finance officer in the US, please, we need all the funds people are contributing. Stop holding it. Stop holding it, please. When our U.S. finance officer makes uh, contact with you, you must please be able to oblige her and do as you're told. Or if you get a call, it's, it's when you fail. Anytime you get a call from our sister Nene, then you know you're in very serious trouble. You have done something wrong. Please make sure that our accounting and our audit is up to date. I do not understand the, the reluctance of some individuals in the U.S. to remit the money that people have contributed to ESN. I don't understand the reason why you're holding it. I don't know what for. Please. That was why we left those criminals with money in Georgia, and they stole it. Trying to, 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 to be clever by half. I should I say too clever by half, like the friend will always do. The two criminals living in Atlanta, Georgia, followed our money. No Kenko and those Rumba. Two criminals. Two roads from there stole our money. I have and I have maintained that any account that we have that Nenayana cannot see, 
I do not trust every account. As long as he doesn't see it, I will not trust it. And very, very soon, I will shut down every account that Mene Anya cannot see. Very, very soon, he will shut down every account that Nenayanya cannot see. Little did he know that, you know, the enemy already planned on how to create a new account. Umweri. And then, <laughs> because they are prepared before they arrive. Greetings, the great people of Biafra. Greetings, the great people of Africa. And I greet you, I welcome you according to your time zone. While you are joining, share the video, invite other people to join that we may dissect the activities of the enemy, the wickedness of the enemy. I, I hope you heard it you know, correctly from Onion Duma as Nam I hope you heard it you know, because that is an instruction, that is an order. What Mazen Namdekan said here, it is not a suggestion. It is not a suggestion. It is an order, direct order. That is the reason why every other thing and command that you claim you are getting from anybody is only going to lead you into the ditch. Now, we are going to come back. We are going to let me show you something. What I am going to expose to you right now is it is very important that we flash back to see what Mazen Namdekan told us before this, you know, is this thing, you know, happened before he, he was kidnapped. I am going to play for you the words of Mazen Namdekan. Listen to it and listen attentively. We are live and direct. It is two minutes before the top of the hour. We, our, I am late. You know, I supposed to be here half past three before time. Pardon me again, but we are here now. Let us listen to this before we proceed, because I want to bring one, very one or two together for you to understand what is going on. We, I want to configure for you to see exactly what is going on. Then you will now decide for yourself what you want. Because so many of you, you do not know where, what you want. You don't know exactly what we're doing here. You don't know what we are doing here. What we are doing here is to make sure that the IPOB runs smoothly. We are not doing it because we are, we are you know, we are, you know, occupying positions in IPOB, but we are doing it to make sure that our struggle is not sold, is not slandered, is not, you know, is not hijacked. Our struggle must run, swift, you know, smoothly until we achieve our goals. That is the reason why we are here. Let us listen to this instruction, another instruction, a prophecy, so that we will proceed from there. Then after this instruction, then you will understand what I am going to show you because I am going to show you, expose to you what this auto, you do autopilot, Nelly, Eberima, or Febu, you know, they are using our men on the ground to do. I am going to show you what they are using those men on the ground to do. Exactly, you know, for you to understand that they take money from you in the name they're going to fix this man on the ground but they take money from you to make sure that they have, you know, all it takes to destroy this man on the ground. Let me show you something before we go, we'll go there. But there is one thing I want all of us to understand this very evening. We are facing a very formidable array of enemies, both external and within. And we are going to overcome each and every one of these obstacles. That I can assure you. We that are. they may know that the God we worship is an invisible God, not a God that was wrought by the hands of men. For we do not worship idol, and we can never ever worship idol is impossible. 
This very family, this IPOB belongs to the Most High. Chukwu Kikabi, I'm putting me here in, and that is how it's going to be until the Africa comes and be on. To eternity. This evening, I want to place it on record that our enemies are intensifying their attack against us. They are from the enemy is in the I'm going to bring to light all the you know this prophecy, what how it unfolded. This is woman and can get the face. Before them, those who are working in the spirit, those who are working, you know, kind man, and Africa. I am not saying this as lamentation or complaint. I am only trying to prepare our people for what is to come. You are being prepared what is to come. The time comes to spread the child. How it is? Are we coming out clear? Are we coming out clear now? Are we coming out clear, guys? The voice is still not clear. Is it what you're saying? Are we coming out clear right now? Are we coming out clear right now? Okay, okay, I will get back. I will, I'm, I'm working on that. Thank you very much. Uh, let me try and see. So, are we, okay, yes, it is better. Somebody confirmed that. So, it is better now. So I believe it will it will be even better while we are going there. It will be even better. Thank you very much for that confirmation. Thank you very much. So now let us let me bring you to the prophecy of Mazen Namdekano. What Mazen Namdekano used to prepare our mind to make us to be at high alert, even though many of us. We were carried away because of the emotion of what happened to him. But we picked up for our pieces, you know, within a short period of time. That is the reason why I am bringing this to you so that you will understand you will be ready because the time he was talking about is right here we are. So listen and listen attentively. Please both external and within. And we are going to overcome each and every one of these obstacles. That I can assure you, that they may know that the God we worship is an invisible God, not a God that was brought by the hands of men. For we do not worship idol and we can never ever worship idol is impossible. This very family, this IPOB, we are going to, to overcome high. them. 
Chukwu Kikadi Amapuru Miheni and that is how it's going to be until Biafra comes and beyond to eternity. This evening, I want to place it on record that our enemies are intensifying their attack against us from every country. I am not saying this as lamentation or complaint. I am only trying to prepare our people for what is to come. You are being prepared for what is to come. Our enemy are intensifying their attacks against us. He want to put it on, you know, on the notice of, uh, uh, you know, our warriors that the enemy is intensifying. The enemy is intensifying that you must be prepared for what is to come. You must be prepared for what is to come. And now you will hear how they will start what is to come. When you hear how they will start what is to come, now I will present to you, you know, the result of all this, you know, prophecy of Mazen Nandikan. So pay very good attention. Don't go anywhere. The time has come to separate the chaff from the wheat itself. Our march is very, very near. The enemies are crumbling, they are quaking, they are doing all they can to try to stop us. But they have failed very woefully and they will continue to fail. But I want to tell you that we are getting attacks from everywhere, from everywhere all over the world. And very soon they will buy over some of you. They will. Some of you, they will buy some of you over. The spirit of Obad, Yasika, and they will fail woefully. We are getting attacked from everywhere, all over the world. Very soon, some of you, they will buy some of you. The spirit of Obad, Ifajuna, is still in, in some of you. <laughs> are you paying attention? They will buy some of you very soon. You know, speaking of the witch. The witch is now everywhere. They will buy some of you. I hope you are paying a very good attention to what Mazen Namdekanu was, you know, telling you, was informing you, was getting you or preparing you that it is going to happen. And we are going to bring it to you, how it is happening. Just like we've been doing ever since he left. The Fajuna is still in some of you. When the time comes, they'll buy you over. I am not doing this program tonight to ask all of you to be strong. I am doing it to remind you, not that if they succeed in buying you over, you're not going to stop what we're doing. You can't. Not in a three, you cannot. Not in a trillion years. But I need you to appreciate one very simple fact. That at the end of did you see what we were saying? He is not doing the program to tell us to be, you know, to make us scared or for as a lamentation. Even if they buy you over, just like so many of you, you sold your conscience direct and indirect in order to sabotage what we are doing. Even if they buy some of you, it will never stop what we are doing. All of you, all of you, both the, you know, the danger weed in my comment section, because most of the people who are commenting rubbish today are the danger weed in the comment section. There is no, you know, Biafrans. Biafrans have retreated now. They want to know what is the outcome of these things that is happening recently. The real Biafrans that have a spirit of uh, repentance, you know, but the, you know, those, Paid agent, recharge card paid agents that are sewage rats in the comment section, they will never change. They will never change. Expect them to continue what they are doing because they are janja weed. The same criminals that were always attacking Mazen Namdekan whenever he is online, trying to debunk the activities of the zoo. That is what is going on right now. Expect no change from them as we continue. 
because these people, they have come to steal, to kill, and to destroy. Of course, we have given you a lot of tips on how you are going to recognize these people. But the problem is that some of our people, they are actually very, very slow in thinking. Some of you, you get captivated with things that, you know, glitters. Some of you, you get captivated when people are just with talking you, you know, they are brainwashing you. But listen to Mazen now they can. Then uh, you will understand. If you pay very good attention to the voice note of Mazen Namdekano, then you will understand what he said when I present to you what is going on. This very race, everybody will testify that indeed Chukwogi Kabiyama, the same God of Israel, of Abraham, Isaac, and Jesus, the same God of Ehiri in Aguleri, the same God of Umweri, the same God of Ora Eri, the same God of Owe Eri, the same God of Arochuku. Not if you know what the, the, the true God, one true God. You will know that indeed, not only is he omnipotent, that that same God is the owner of this very agitation. No human being can stop it. We have enemies and we need to be very, very careful, both within and without very very careful the next two weeks will be very pivotal next two weeks will be very very important in the life or should i say in this very human being there is no human being that will be able to stop it we need to be very very careful we need to be very very careful nobody will stop it no one will stop us they will only try just like they are trying, just like they are all over the place, they will never stop us. There is no way any man will stop this because this is a just cause and this is the spirit leading this Biafra struggle. You can't. You can, if you, you can try. You will never stop us. Let us continue. Mission that we have embarked upon. The devil will do everything. And you are going to watch spectacularly how we are going to destroy and shame the enemy. That at the end, every glory and adoration will belong to God and not to man. Now let us go and tell you what is happening that some of you do not understand. I want those of you who are hardcore, those who we are chosen before you we are born. There were some people who we are chosen before they we are born to agitate for Biafra restoration. This is a message for you. Those who, we, from their mother's womb, they were born yes. to do this very work. You must be very, very strong. We are here. Because Biafra will open the eyes of black people all over the world. Because Biafra will mean that... He wants the hardcore. There are people, you know, who were chosen before they were born. He wants them to be here at this point in time because this, this Biafra is going to open the eyes of every black man. The people who are, you know, willing to be in this struggle, the hundred men, some of them, he want them to be prepared to prepare to face the biggest enemy in this struggle. That is the reason why you see so many faces you don't understand, so many faces you don't know, so many people, they have come out to fight the battle. If you are, you know, we did not come here because we want to be here or we enjoy being here. We came here because we know it is the right time to be here. So many of you believe that uh, we like to be on the Facebook, on YouTube, you know, broadcasting just for the, you know, for the sake of it. Do you know that when my, when my kids hear that uh, there will be no broadcast tonight, they will be very happy. They will be very happy because at least I will have to spend time with them.
That is part of it. We are not here because we are here because we are prepared to do the, to be here today, and that is the reason why we owe nobody apology for what we are doing. Nobody, regardless of how you feel, we owe you no apology for doing what we are doing. We are not here for relevance. Chukwu kika bi amahado already made me relevant. We are not here to, you know, to, to, to lie to you to gain anything. Chukwo Kikabeama has blessed me. I am okay. I am contented. I am actually rather content with what I've got. So I am not here to, you know, to please a man. I am here to fight for our freedom. And I know that so many of you who are real, you know, people who are supposed to, you know, not supposed to be in existence of mankind, you will be in the comment section writing rubbish, writing junk. And a lot of you are beer friends. So many of you are ginger weed. So many of you writing in the name of, you know, in the name of Igbo name or Biafra names. Fulani and Boko Haram, they have taken over your lands in the north. All you do is to come here with the recharge card they have given you. You are writing junk to defend infiltrators in IPOB. Omolai Mohammed, Ndebelai Mohammed, you know, recruited Lai Mohammed. That is what you are here doing. This, you know, remove yourself from here. Otherwise, you stay here and hear the gospel. Because today I am not actually in the mood in order to entertain you writing rubbish in my comment section. I am not in that mood. Because our people have, you know, are dying. Our people are being killed by these infiltrators. So if you believe that you are, I am here to tolerate your nonsense in that comment section, don't even try to, you know, to actually try me. Because I am going to curse you. Let us continue. Blacks from America, blacks from the Caribbean, from, from Southern America, they will all flood into Africa. It will be like the time that Yeshua was born. Biafra is like a light to become. They will follow it. They will say, let us go and see what is happening there. That is what these new colonialists do not want. They don't want Biafra to come. I am telling our people so they understand. The mountains, I didn't say one mountain, the mountains in front of us that we need to overcome. And for us to overcome it, we need to be very strong mentally, mental strength. Just like when you're doing anything in life, and it appears as if you are being buffeted from everywhere. That is the time that you no longer rely on willpower or your muscles. You go to your brain to endure and to persevere and to keep going until you overcome. That is the stage we are in right now. To make sure that our brain is in gear. To confront everything the ginger weed has to throw at us. We don't have money. Their budget is over $20 billion to fight us. They can bribe Facebook. They can buy them off. They can do anything they like. They can. You know, it is not something you do with muzzle or a willpower. Did you listen to that? You go to your brain. Because now, the enemy went to their brain in order to, you know, cook something to manipulate your own brain. So that is the reason why it is not something you have to do with willpower or muscles. But you go to your brain because they have gone into your brain. They have planted seeds that is growing into your brain for you to abandon what you are supposed to be, you know, what you are supposed to be supporting. Because of that, they have you know, placed you in the comment section 
whenever the real gospel is being preached, they will place you on the comment section. You will be writing junk. It will remain Finland. And uh, all of you, I can see you in that comment section. I see you in that comment section. It will remain Finland. I see you in that comment section. And I am going to block you. You know, I am going to block you. Because I have not started talking about you, Obi Anthony. So now, that is what Mazen Namdekan is say, was saying. If you listen to it, he said it is not a muscle fight. It is it is something you need to go to brain. Mental strength, because it will last for a while. Mental strength. And that mental strength is the, the only thing that will make you. Even if they are writing junk in comment section, it motivates you the more. Don't worry, I want you to remember this part. They will use it tomorrow. Even if they are writing junk, even if they are talking junk, you know, against you, you need mental strength, mental strength to withstand and keep pushing. That's what it is. That's what it is. Because what we are doing now is, you know, fighting against the manipulation approach, the manipulative approach, the manipulations of the enemy. That's exactly what we are fighting against right now. You think we are fighting against uh, uh, Simon? Yeah? You think we are just fighting against the Nelly of Abel? You think we are just fighting against the, all this uh, um, Obido? Is it the, who is all those people? Obido, being? You think we are just fighting against you, Chamorfo? We are not. We are fighting against the manipulations of the evil doers. <laughs> That's what we are fighting against, which you, you, know, you know as infiltrator. That's what we are fighting against. You know, the vessels that they are using to present it is not whom we are fighting. We are fighting what they are presenting. And unfortunately, when we are emotional, we call their names. When we are emotional, you know, we, 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 know, we, we call them names. But exactly what we are doing is to fight that energy that they are releasing inside our people. That is brainwashing them. That is making some of them to write junk. That is making some of them to preach junk. That's what we are fighting against. And we are prepared. We are prepared. No going back. No more going back. Because we have seen the atrocities of these evil doers. Listen and listen good. So that you will understand that we don't have problem with anybody. You should make sure that your brain is in gear to confront what is going on. If our brain or China Samor, if his brain was not in gear, structure is supposed to be destroyed today by now. But the brain is in gear. My brain is in gear. Likewise, the brain of all these men that is supporting the truth, their brain is in gear. Because that is what Mazen Nandekan told us. That is how it is. Listen. Come to some of you and bribe you off. They can promise you what you've never had before. They can give you maybe a house in Dubai. They can promise you a vehicle. They can tell you, oh, we'll make you vice president. They can promise you anything to make sure that you're like them. But this very IPOB, this very hardcore is not going to move. And I will tell you why we can't move. They will come to some of you, bribe you off. Gosh, gosh. 
They will promise you heaven on earth. They will give you what you never had. That is what is happening today. That is what will ha is happening today. A lot of you, only that they buy, they pay for your um, um, studio. And some of you, only because of a studio, <laughs> made you derail. Only for a studio. Talk more about those who are paying for your studio. What is the catch? You never ask yourself, you are paying for my studio to promote something. You didn't ask yourself, what's the catch? What's the leverage? You never ask yourself that. Only studio. Talk more of the people that are buying laptops, giving money, putting on a payroll. You never ask yourself questions. I follow Mazen Namdekan. I love Mazen Namdekan. Our leader, our leader, our leader. Every day, our leader. What you hear from there, our leader, our leader, our leader. Let me bring to you the voice of Nelly. Okay, let me bring to you this voice first for you to understand what is going on. Listen to the voice I am going to present to you. We should get uh, 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 this is the man on the ground that they claim every day they are donating money for. This is, the, you know, the man on the ground that every day they are telling you our voice in the ground, our man in the ground, ESN, ISN. Look at what they are telling you. The man in the ground, on the ground. Listen to them. Listen attentively because this is actually to build for you a background of the real exposition that I am here to do. Because I, I will show you things that you have seen and things that you may have seen, but you don't understand where, you know, the reason it happened, the origin of what you have seen. Listen attentively. Oh, innocent people can find a waste if they are wasting the blood of people in the name of that they are in charge of ESN. Oh, innocent people can find a waste in the name of ESN, ISN. Every day you donate your money. That is the reason why I told you. Those who heard my voice, the time you donated that money in the name of you are donating for ESN, you know, that place it is coming from, it is going, it was, you know, I told you it is going to dry. How far all of you who heard me and you continued, how far? How far? Now listen very good, listen very attentively. You, if you donate money that these people are wasting the innocent blood on the ground, you are accomplice to that killing of our people. I want you to pay attention. If you have given your money, even though you heard it when I was saying it, when I was telling you that, you know, you are donating money to kill our people, that blood of these people is in your head. He said, it is in your head. He said, it is in your head. And it will block where that money is going to come out from. Or where it has ever come that came out from. Because we warned you. You wouldn't say you were not listening. You were not hearing it. It is all over the place. Let us continue. Our men on the ground are crying. Our men on the ground are bleeding. Ever since these people claim that they are in charge and taking care of our men on the ground, I want you to pay attention to them. Chief autopilot, Omo Benetin, you know all the his brokers. Omo Benetin, you know, I say, let him hear. 
innocent that are Eastern Security Network, New State. A bomb on how our bank, how they focus, their mind, they are, they are trying to find all miss to conquer us. Which is all hands and all hands supposed to be on the decks to make sure that these people will, will never succeed on their evil plans. But Amazon has a joint in a plan. These are the men on the ground. He said that he does not know whether this is a perima in Finland and among those old criminals all over the place have joined the enemy because they are not well informed. That is the reason why he is still saying he doesn't know whether they have joined. I want to tell you if you will ever hear. They have joined them. They have joined them. He said he don't know if he has joined the enemy. He is the enemy himself. So don't say you don't know whether they have joined the enemy. That is how it is. Our men on the ground are bleeding ever since you started raising funds. Our men on the ground are bleeding ever since you have started hurting criminals, ever since you started, you know, using, you know, turning people that devoted themselves to do something good. How they win over these guys, they motivated them with what happened to Mazen Namdekan, bringing, you know, the voice of Mazen Namdekan, telling them that, you know, Mazen Namdekan will say, if you look for him, you don't see him. You must do this, you must do that. That is how they actually brainwash those men on the ground. Some of them to, you know, to take them, some of them and turn the rest against the other and turn them against the ones who refuse to rebel. They keep they are donating money. They are raising money to, you know, to go and sabotage this man on the ground. That's what they were donating money for. Giving this some of these few people, few members of their syndicates that were on the ground, some, you know, giving them some of the money, giving them peanuts, enriching themselves with the rest, calling the shot for the people to go out there to go and kill themselves, to go and die. That's what these people are doing. And that is how, if you look at it, the way they brainwash our men on the ground, because our men on the ground are not in the media. Our men on, on the ground are the people who are, were at high risk of being brainwashed. So if you see some of them being brainwashed today, or even being, you know, lured into doing something that they, they are not supposed to be doing, you should know that these people out there, they started moving fast. They were preaching to them, to giving them voice notes of Mars and Nambu. Because these people, they were prepared with, you know, their manipulative approaches, you know, you know, this 100 percent. There is 100 percent accurate when they are discharging it. If they want to manipulate you, 100 percent. As long as you are not prepared, as long as you have, you know, you don't know exactly, you know, what you are doing. These people, they, they definitely they are going to manipulate you. Listen to this guy before we move on. Okay. But you could carry them out of God will never allow them. All God in the night, night, Joseph, who shall conquer. That is how he made it to be. Oh, God in the night, they will conquer to show you that, you know, these people every time, our men on the ground, our men on the ground. Every day you are taking money that belongs to our men on the ground to give them to go and fight our men on the ground. Are you listening? Continue. It's not by our power. Oh, behind our Lord God. No, she could cut them and I'll go. Oh, and I'll lie. So that is how it is. That is it. Even if they have a stick, that they will, con they will still conquer. Let me bring you now how Nelly of Ebu, how Mazi Nelly, a very man, Joko of Ebu, is killing our people. 
Nelly of Ebu, a very man, Joko Oyibo, Mazi Oyibo, and among others, I heard Bridget is part of them. Now, let me show you how they are clean our people. And I want to make you to understand something about Nelly of Ebu. Nelly of Ebu is that woman that when she is speaking, she will be shouting on top of her voice. You know, so that you will believe that what she is preaching to you, you know, it is the truth that she confirmed. That is a psychology. That is a psychology using, you know, creating an emotion, creating an atmosphere where your emotion will be now is nearly available. He's crying on top of his voice. He's preaching the same thing. Does it mean there is something? He wanted to be one year so that it becomes a norm. To get to a black man, keep preaching one thing. Don't change your topic. Keep preaching it until it becomes a norm to them. She understands that that she understands that psychology. And that is what she the reason why she is using it, raising every day, screaming on top of her voice as if she has nothing else but you know trying to show you something great. But you don't know she is trying to lead you to destruction. That woman is a Delilah, she's a Lucifer herself. Believe you me, she is very, very manipulative. She is, you know, one you want me. Because I'm calling her one you want me so that you will understand that philosophy to place it in your own, you know, in your own level of philosophy. You know those people you call mommy water according to your philosophy. That is the reason why I am bringing it down to your philosophy. That is that woman you see there. Let us hear from her so that the reason why I warned you first about how she, you know, promote herself, how she is busy, you know, presenting herself, crying on top of her voice is I'm warning you actually because I'm bringing, you know, the voice to the screen because I, I want to tell you, you know, the listener's destruction is advice because these people are very manipulative. You supposed to, if you know that you are not strong or mentally strong enough, you are not supposed to be going to listen to a Berimah in Finland. You are not supposed to be paying attention to um, a Berimah Mazinelli of Ebu. You are not supposed to be listening to these two. If you are, if you are not mentally strong to be, you know, to manipulation, you don't listen to these people. Otherwise, if you want to listen to these people, bring people like me close. When you are listening to them, we will be analyzing it for you. That is what is going on. Let me play this video for you. This voice of Nelly for you, rather. Simon Akban. Oh, uh... Not this one. Oh. I think I am using the same. Okay, let me bring that video. I think I am using the wrong one. Let me bring that video because I, I put a picture in front of them are the same because they are actually the same video. So let me bring the other one. Just one minute. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me look for this. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Ah, what's going on? 
let's see let's look for this again okay 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 no 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 this one goes there how come they are the same just give me a minute just give me a minute let me find this video this a uh, voice note of this woman called Nelly for you to understand because that's where we are going to bring one or two together and I will show you the breaking news after the voice note you will see the breaking news so that you will know that whenever we speak you will understand that we are not noisemakers. We are not jealous or fighting against <clears throat> anybody's or any personal opinion. We are fighting to present the truth for to you. Okay. Which one is this? The last one, if it doesn't show. Wow. Why is it that is all the, just one moment. Let's find this video, one moment. Okay, if we cannot find it, let me play it from the phone directly. Let me play it from the phone. I thought I I prepared that video, but I can see right now it is not exactly, I am not seeing it anymore. I am not seeing the video anymore. Let me bring, play it from the phone directly. As I remember, I prepared it. But all the same, we are prepared. We make a backup plan. We made a backup plan. Now, let me play it to you. Listen and listen attentively. Today is April 1st in Indo land. Tafam Bonelli of April. Oh, see, I was in the garden there. Today is April 1st in Indo land. What Nelly is doing here now, I want you to pay very, you know, pay very good attention. What Nelly is doing here right now, Nelly is doing a confession. You know, we, we talked about this yesterday, but I didn't know where, you know, this is going or where it is coming from. She is doing a confession on how she, he set, you know, the people that are involved in her talk, how he set them up. She set them up on the 28th of March. She spoke this on the 1st of March. Are you paying attention? She said this on the 1st of March. But 28th of March, she already set them up. Now she now she was saying this on the 1st of April, rather. Now pay very good attention for you to understand the content of her words. You will understand the content of her words. Then you when I present to you the manifestation of what she said how she planned after dealing with it after solving these people then she's now coming to tell you they buy in day one so that those people will not even know where their problem is is coming from they will not know where their problem is coming from you know it is not about emo state only because they have the same members of this syndicate that move around they move there they might be in an Anambra state and they will be operating somewhere in Imo State. They might be in Imo State. They will be operating somewhere in a point state. They might be in a point state. They will be, you know, they move. 
like this. Wherever they want to go for the operation, of course, you know the activities of the uh, criminals in, in the land. How wherever they want to move, so that uh, I don't want you to, to say Imo State, Anambra, distance is not their barrier. Distance is not their barrier because those people actually, they can actually take cars. They take people's cars, they take people, you know, they are robbing people as well. So that you will understand what is going on. Saboteur against sabot sabots of ESN. Let me play it. All the demonic food in our bushes. As Chukwekika Biyama is cleaning the house on land, so is Chukwekika Biyama also cleaning the bushes. Because Chukwekika Biyama himself will select his warriors. Mm -hmm. Chukwekika Biyama. Did you hear what she said? As Chukwekika Biyama is cleaning the land, the land, or the, you know, it's also Chukwekika Biyama is cleaning the bushes. As Chukwo Kikabiyama is cleaning the, you know, the online, Chukwo Kikabiyama is cleaning the bushes. So that is God will now that his Chukwo Kikabiyama, her own Elohim, will now, which is Owa, will now produce the people that will fight for Idu. Are you paying attention? So that when we are telling you what we are telling you, you will understand it. The reason why she said that Chukwu Kikabiam is cleaning the, you know, the online, the online is, you know, what Eberima in Finland is busy, has, you know, instilling in you that the leadership of IPOB, they are all criminals. That is the cleaning online. The cleaning on the ground is that these people, they are actually using, some of them, they are sabotaging the ESN. Some of them, they, you know, all of them, they are dressing like ESN. They are, if they make a place, find a place to stay, they will, you know, put the settings at ESN. In case of any casualty, they will say it is ESN. They don't know that it is Nelly, Nelly Eperima, Njoku of Ebu. Those are the people that are, they are not ESN because ESN is IPOB. IPOB is ESN. So whoever they are working with is with Nelly Eberima. These are the things, the name they should, they are, you know, you will know that it is those people that they are working for that are busy sabotaging and killing our men on the ground. That are busy sabotaging and exposing and killing our men on the ground, making our men on the ground look like a criminal, making the name of our men on the ground dirty. These are the people. Listen attentively. I want you to write this place down, you know, double lion. I want you to write it down because when I present the breaking news, you will understand where it is coming from. You will understand where it is coming from so that you will know that this Nelly of Fable is busy killing the man on the ground, busy killing the man on the ground, using fake people, Aburu Park, the in that year that he, they are recruiting in a book in a bony state or a bakereke him shim him and uh, or shim and the nel and the uh, epelima in finland they are busy recruiting that young and doctor than and the of the doctor than a female ganya and then double mobuna and one of moto load noon they will be recruiting those people promising them the money that you are donating for them so that the reason why I keep reminding you of the money you are donating for them is for you to know that you are part of these people destroying our men on the ground. So if you want, if you have conscience, let your conscience begin to eat you up right now. If you have one, let us continue because you will not say we did not warn you. They are now using them, sabotaging the, our men on the ground. 
using them, you know, giving them names which is, you saw that he have their data. Now listen. When you hear Lion Lion, these were, you know, members of ESN. These were members of ESN that was brainwashed and to took, they took them away from the camp and turned them against the camp, turned them against, you know, the, 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 the real men on the ground, give them a new mode of operation, give them, you know, put them on their, on their payroll. Now, Today, when you know, since the beginning of this uh, past month of March, this lion, lion that she is talking about, I think he he started challenging them, started asking questions, started telling them that what we are hearing is no longer what we, you know, you you told us. We have now we are now hearing the truth. We are now hearing what is going on. You people have been using us to commit uh, your atrocities. All this something you know like that that they've been you know discussing with this um, Nelly of that Nelly now waited. She, she knows that these people are going to destroy what he is doing. These people are going to destroy what he is doing. They are doing. Knowing that these people, they don't have their own camp anymore because they are no longer with ESN. They resign from ESN. They follow the autopilot you do. Now, there is fire on the mountain. Guess what happened? The person who brainwash you and bring you out, the same person put you on the news. Let us, let us, let us listen to it before. Let us listen to it. For you to know Lion Lion is Nelly of Fable, Nelly of Fable, but my friend is Lion Lion. I want you to pay very good attention because some of you will think that this Lion Lion is actually ESN of our, is our own passion. Is IPOB ESN. Lion Lion is not IPOB ESN. It is Nelly Ofebu and the, the other one, you know, when he now discover what is going on that they have they are being used, he now starts asking questions, making voice notes. Why is this like this? Why is that like that? But he does not know that once you have gone, you know, you know if you go south in, on, from the ground, you will never go home. If you go south from the ground, you will never go home. The reason why if you go south from the ground, you will never go home is because what you are doing, you are cleaning the calamity of another people into our land. So whenever you go south and start committing the calamity, you will never go home. That is exactly what I am saying. For you to understand that he started telling them, you know, that the China Samoru, this and that, Kanon Takano, he started now comparing. That's what he is doing. He started comparing. And while he is still at it, Nelly of <laughs> set her up. I will show you. Let us continue. Is that the point you're trying to make? So that it's going to look like Kanon Takano and China Samoru know what is going on in the bush. <laughs> Because Double Lion have begun to ask questions. Double Lion is beginning to ask questions. Now Double Lion is now working, he now shifting the blame of who Double Lion is working for. Because now I am going to make it very clear for you, especially if you if you say put and don't go anywhere and pay attention, I will make it brightly clear for you so that you will know that these people are evil. You will know when Mazen Nambekanu say we need this. Brain strength, strength from your brain is what we will use to overcome. Now listen. Why are you bringing Kanan and Takano and Chinata in our issues? When was the last time you got money from them? 
comparison. How can you? When was the last time you got money from them to show you that these are the fallen angels? The fallen angels. When you fall, you will never rise. The fallen angels. When did you get money from Canon Takano China Samor? Because ever since you became a fallen angel, now you are comparing. You are, you know, it looks like you know he is comparing between you know the time they were still in heaven and now that they have fallen onto the earth. He is now comparing, fallen into the hands of a Berimaneli of Abu. Listen to it. Did you see how did you see how the DSS and Nelly and all those fallen angels are linked together? They are linked together. You will tell the whole world why you brought a child to the ESN to claim that Mazen Namdekan is recruiting ESN. Nelly of Fable knew about that you know plan. And Nelly Ofebu and his cohort DSS, who you know, of course, they are working with, knew that, you know, this way, we if you do this this way, you know, and uh, Nigeria government, they pick up anything junk from the media, use it and uh, open a new country. Like Let's do this. And the world will also see that these people are not serious. They are terrorists. You know, let us bring this one or two together bring a child give him gun let him shoot in front of the whole world so that we will you know we will make these people look to be criminals now after using the same after using them doing it he will now because now they are realizing the magnitude of the atrocities they are committing they are realizing exactly what they are you know doing they have, you know, you know, they have woken up from the slumber of that emotion that their leader is, is being captured. Now, another gospel was given to them. Now, that gospel is now what is destroying them. From Nelly, Abari Eberima, Njoku Ofebu, that is the same, you know, what is going on. Listen and listen attentively so that you will not think that he is trying to, you know, remove this from what we are doing. The child, the boy, of course, the boy, we don't know how, who is the boy. We don't know how the boy came around. It is DSS. Of course, you saw the video where the DSS was kneeling down, acting like they are in the camp. You saw that video. These are people, when I told you that Eberima, Nelly, of Fable, they are working with the DSS. The same reason why I told you that they talked about Isiago, that it is a sentiment made by DSS in their private facility, that are, you know, none of the you know lawyers said it in the public domain. My um, picked it up and told you, no more advocate. Mazen Nam the Kanu should not change clothes again. Mazen Nam the Kanu must not change clothes because they do to do with Isiago. Because DSS told him that if you if you actually make this um, allow this uh, man to change the, the, to this is here, he will start intimidating us here. One day he will tell us to open the gate. We go to that he will walk out. That is exactly what he, you know the DSS was actually proposing that he should make this known. Because DSS is even while they are trying to incriminate Mazen Nam the Khan, they are also careful not to incriminate themselves because they know that our eyes are open and that we are watching. That is what is going on. Listen and listen attentively for you to know the connection between Nelly, Eberimo, Febu, and Joko. The, their connection with the Nigeria DSS. 
Lion, lion, or a book take news on our own. You go give me a book take news of within no. I have a game me the middle of my body. Oh, me the carapom, lion, lion now. Macana, I buy you for game or matches here. Now, for matches, you realize I formal. What have I done? Oh, be a mobby or compare, Bezier. But this is not how we do it when we are with these people. This is not how we do it when we are in with ESN. So that you will understand what is going on. Pay attention. Pay attention. Mm -hmm. Message. Do you know the reason why <laughs> Nelly G when they leave to you know they be on top of her voice is that you know trying to he reminded the DSS court is coming up up you should remember this now he went back she went back and said lion lion you did this because she knows that he told you know these are one of the strategies to implicate the man on the ground that refused to join their, you know, protocols, that refused to join their queue. You know, that is the way to, you know, destroy their names. Now, because question is being asked, Lion Lion is also asking question, why do we need to go this far? This and that, all these things are coming out. Now they now throw it back to the Lion Lion. <laughs> Lion Lion, all go up to the you know, they threw it back to the lion lion. Lion lion, well, on top of one, he's record because all that. And apparently, you lion lion, you are asking too many questions. Apparently, you lion lion, you are demanding more. But that is exactly what is going on. Oh, now I call you, you come keep as well. Listen to it. Because as we speak now, Lion Lion, I don't know if he's still alive or if he's dead or if he's, you know, he is, you know, he's on the run, if he's still alive. On the run. Listen to her. Listen. I've never recruited any minor into ESN. Wow. 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 Hope now. Is it hope? Hope in the DSS. Lion, lion, chineka, bugo, gone, dead, you were, sir. If all the agua look at that, what the reason why he's saying that lion, lion, chineka, bugo, gone, some man of our rubbish go lion, lion. Now, the people that they, you know, they work with, with the lion, lion are now looking for lion, lion. I am going to make it clear to you, show you the evidence to prove what I am saying. The people 
that they are also working for now are looking for lion lion because lion lion now is a rebellious you know come is a rebellious soldier in their syndicate he is now rebelling to the modus of operandi of the syndicate comparing where he was and where he is to where he is right now brother let us continue you found out where that, the reason why he is telling her um, double lion go and uh, uh, ask questions go and uh, seek for you know spiritual consultation is that you know lion lion she already know that she already cooked for lion lion she prepared for lion lion already and after preparing they will come and tell you this is this you know they will use it as a breaking news what happened within the vicinity of lion lion but they will not tell you exactly what is going on listen and listen attentively they will use it as a position that so many of you will think they have information you don't know that they cause problem they cause mayhem they come and use it as a position to you when Eberima is, is, is talking, 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 you will think, ah, Eberima, you are number one. You have information. You you are you have raw information. You don't know that it's those information are being extracted through sabotage. Listen. <laughs> The great spirit of Idu Epocha Bugunu. I want you to understand. The great spirit of Idu Epocha Bugunu. Write it down here. Write it down. So that you will know that these things that I'm, I'm going to show you happened before she started saying this. So that when you hear it, it will look like it is what she said that just happened. Because no problem or no le. Oh, if one are check wagging. Now, if you do look like when Nelly curse you, it will manifest. It will come to manifestation. Listen very attentively. From your land. So, I and I have a question. Mm -hmm. My question for you is where is Saba? Mm -hmm. So, I and I where is Saba? Where is in Jenge? Mm -hmm. Where is King Jaja? Wow. We are looking for King Jaja of Obobo. Do you know the reason why she is talk, calling these people? Where is Injenje? Where is King Jaja? Where is o, 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 this person? It is because they were together. They were all together. Now, if there is eventuality, if there is something that happened, you know, you will understand the reason why she is asking where are those people? Because the plan was to destroy all of them. But eventually, they destroy some of them. Now he is asked, she is asking them, where is those two? So that it will look like they are the ones who knows about those two. But perhaps, or uh, whereas Nelly or Febu is the one who knows better about those two. Are you paying attention? She is the one who knows everything about those two. Because... I know it will still be confusing to you until I present to you the breaking news. It will still be confusing to you, but pay very good attention. So, Abele and Udele, what did you do? What did you people do with Aba? What did you people do with Injenje? What did you people do with Injenje? Where, where, Swab Lord? What did you do with our gallant men? Mm -hmm. Taking videos. 
Did you see now the blame where, where they are shifting the blame? We are, you know, when I am done with this, because I know I am going to be done in the next 20 or 30 minutes. I am going to be done with this exposition in the next 20 or 30 minutes. So stay put. I am going to open the line when we are done with this. So if you want to, in case if you want to call in, our number will be rolling on our on your screen. Uh, the number is rolling on your screen. And then I am going to also share the link for those of you who want to come in person, you know, in order to talk about this. I am going to share the link for you guys to come in. You know, I will share it for, on YouTube. So if you are watching on YouTube, stay put there. I will bring the link to you there. I am going to also share it on Facebook, you know. So now let us continue because we are all we are rounding up. These are our men. At the end of all of their things is all about Mazen Nam the Kano. At the anything Mazen Nam the Kano, what has Mazen Nam the Kano done to these people to mail your favor and co? What did Mazen Nam the Kano do to you, Eberima, in Finland? Because this is Nelly of Febu. Nelly of Febu is a very mind Finland. It is a word that came out of Nelly of Febu, um, in Finland. It is not a word of my mouth. What did Mazen Nam the Kano do did to you guys? You guys need to, need to tell us exactly what Mazen Nam the Kano did to you guys to deserve all this, you know, wickedness against him. To deserve all this wickedness against him. When you say that this woman is insane, this woman, I have beginning to understand that this woman is not insane. Kadwada, this woman is not insane. This woman, Yilasana, Satonanya, Nebifone, this woman is not insane, but he is going to be insane. Oh, Yilasana, Satonanya, Nebifone, if I am a Lifone, I can swear on you, but I can know the guy who took off my wound and I knew. If I am a Lifone, I now is that now. Boge kune kuo kuo ne kuo ta e file no ni amame wata na no na afun an no na afun dem one and dem one esios. Are you paying attention? You get feeling and dem one esios. Why I go to Melly for one? Me I want go to scream on top of her voice. This is a way to manipulate you. No mo pay ko wul na abalan wine. And dem one zina agio. No pay ko je alaplo ni aka. That is the reason why he is he is doing what he is doing. That is the psychology she want to bring because they know that one whenever it, it's all about things you know that concerns things of the spirit things of this thing you know you become very very emotional. That is the reason why he is she is lamenting. Onya alada bakuya o onya isi di kuyamu o onya now I begin to act agree fully with one lady can call from the United States that say that this woman. Maybe is a is a is a you know is a psychologist. Somehow she knows psychology. That is the reason why she is presenting it, and she she understands the emotions of our people. 
That's why she is presenting it this way. Presenting it this way. And you will think, ah, she can't be wrong. She can't be fooling around. The way she is screaming this, she cannot be fooling around. She is damn serious. She cannot be fooling around. That is the psychology. Now let us finalize it and I will bring it in. Benjamin, all of you, Okunan, you people are seeing what is going on now. You people are seeing what is going on now. Remember that some of these, you know, these people he is calling their names are actually, you know, some of them <laughs> that is calling their names, some of them, they, are, they might not be real yet, but they are not working with her. And, they, you know, and some of them might be lamenting genuinely. They might be lamenting genuinely. The reason why she is calling most of these people, <laughs> you know, from the beginning, Lion Lion, from the beginning, Lion Lion is her boy, her boy that is rebelling now. <laughs> Are you paying attention? Her boy that is currently rebelling now, but she already put the Lion Lion on the wrong, but let us continue. Wow. Somebody says he's ranting, but ranting on Facebook. You don't know the power of Facebook. She is ranting, but on Facebook, but you don't know the power of how she is ranting. Now I am going to bring to you to show you that she's not only ranting on Facebook. She is not only ranting on Facebook. Let us go to the breaking news that this woman is killing, bringing you out from where you're supposed to be serving your nation diligently, making you a criminal, turning around and killing you. That's what this woman is doing. Let me bring this to you for you to know exactly that what she is saying, it is not just a, a, a Facebook noise. She is killing our men on the ground. She is killing our men on the ground. It is not a Facebook noise. Let us bring this. Now, while we are here, I want you to pay very good attention. It is a breaking news that I am going to read for you. A breaking news. I am going to bring this breaking news. I will read it for you. Now, okay, let me do this so that it will be brighter. It will be brighter on your screen. Let me bring it to be clearer to your screen that you will understand exactly what I am showing you. Because at the end of the day, they know that everything they do, they will call it, the name they will use is ESN. The name they will use is ESN. I want you to pay attention for you to understand that the name they will use is ESN. Listen, let's go to the news. Let's go to the news. Before we go to the news, share this video. Invite more people to join if you are here for the first time click the notification button so that you will get notification whenever we are online click the notification button allow all the notification so that you will get notification whenever we are sending out a very important information to click the notification button you click on top of the video 
you click on the video. When you click on the video, then you will see the notification button popping out below. You click on it, it is like a bell. You click on it, then you will be able to get notified whenever we come online. Um, I called you by mistake. I, I was trying to do something. Are you, hello? Okay. Go ahead. Okay, no, it's not. Hmm. Oh. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Thanks very much. Thanks very much for that. It is very, very important. Thank you. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> While we are, uh, I did not know. Okay, let's go there first. Let's go there first. Let's go there first. Then we will, you know, we will understand what is going on before I bring in the new information that just came in now. There is a very, very new information that just came in now. Let us go and read the news. I want you to let us confirm, you know, the curse of Nelly. Nelly already set these people up to go and die before she started telling you Chineka Ogun Opu, Chineke Pocha Pugun, a land of Idu Pocha Pugun. The ones that he is still threatening, he is still threatening are the ones that are now, they were not captured. The ones that were not captured, but all of them, all the names that she mentioned are actually working for Nelly of Eden. I thought, you know, now I have I, I, I have seen all of them are the ones working for Nelly of Ebu. None of them is connected to the ESN. None of them is connected to the ESN. I want to show you right now. Now read what is there. I hope you can see it clearly, what is in front of your screen. Look at it. It says, let me refresh because I see our network is collapsing slowly. Let me refresh. Okay, I just refreshed right now. Let us proceed. Let us proceed. I hope I am still coming out clear. I hope I am still coming out clear. All these people now, I have seen them. All these people. Okay, somebody confirmed it on the comment section as well that they are indeed the all of them that she mentioned because I, I thought that the ones she mentioned are actually the innocent ones. They are all as guilty as Nelly of Ebu. So now let me read the news. But I see my network is actually still frustrating. My network is still frustrating. I don't know why. Um, let me refresh one more time. Please stay put. Let me refresh. So, I don't know if we are still coming out. Are we coming out clear? It is still not stable. But let us continue. Let us continue. Okay, somebody confirmed that we are clear. We are clear. Let us proceed. Let me also confirm from this side that we are coming out clearly.
Okay. That means we are very clear. We are very clear. Let us read this. Let us read for you to understand exactly what is going on. If you can read in front of your screen, troops, troops on IPOB ESN hideout. Troops on IPOB ESN hideout. Now we go ahead and read the news. This was this this thing happened on the. Let us see the the date of the news. I want you to see the date of the news here. Are you seeing the date of the news where I highlighted? It is updated March 28, 2022. That was when the news happened. That was when the news happened. Now we go ahead to read. For you to know that this news happened even before Nelly. You know, she made sure that she, she attacked these guys, that she, she loved to work for her. Now when they start rebelling, she made sure that she want to shut them up for good. You know, a criminal will always call a person a criminal. Remember, whenever they, this type of thing happened, they will come and tell you that uh, China Samoru, she will use them. She will, if they refuse to command, then they refuse to obey the command and control again, they will set them up and kill them. That is exactly what these people are up to. That's exactly their modus of operandi. That is the reason why they now wanted to blame it on. Tina Samoru and the IPOB. Now let us continue to read. Troop of 82 Division, Nigeria Army, conducted clearance operation along Anambra Imo State border communities today, dislodged a criminal hideout used by the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB and its armed affiliate, Eastern Security Network, ESN, in Osumo, Ihiala local government area of Anambra State. Now, listen and listen attentively. Did you hear that this media, this gutter media houses, all the things I've been telling them when they want to confirm, you know, they, when they, before they present their news, they should be able to confirm the authenticity of their news before presenting their news. If they are not able to confirm the authenticity of their news to report it accurately, they should not present their news. Because you cannot tell me that we've been on social media all over this time, telling you that there are infiltrators, there are people, criminals being harsh all over, you know, Biafra land, trying to use it to sabotage ESN. Likewise, the children. And when we tell you that it is, you know, this autopilot you do, they are the people who created that, you know, shenanigan of a child, giving a child a gun, giving them a uniform. But have you forgotten that Mazen Namde can say no more recruitment? Have you forgotten that DSDOS said that we are no longer accepting any new recruitment in the ESN? You people will not hear what we are presenting to you. You know, all you people we keep doing is to re be reporting junk. Is to keep reporting junk. Channel TV already joined uh, AIT to report junk. You say any place where you find government, you call them ESN and IPOB. That's what you people are doing recently. Is that not... Is that not, you know, is that a, a you know, a investigative journalism that you people are doing? Because you people are, are lying against people. You people are lying against another people. Let me finish reading it, then I will now tell you exactly what is going on. Now, listen attentively. In a statement, military spokes. Man, Brigadier General Onyema Mawachuku explained that the notorious group have serially launched attacks on defenseless civilians and security largest from, the, from their hideout. During the clearance operation along the border communities, troops were met with 
stiff resistance from the you know dissident element from the dis from one minute from the dissident element as they closed in their enclave as they are closed in their enclave now, police foil attack by suspected IPOB members in Imo City. We are going to come back to that news as well, that one. Let us continue with this. They were overwhelmed. They were overwhelmed by troops. Superior firepower, forcing them to abandon their hideout after overrunning their camp. The gallant troops carried out Further exploitation and recovered a catchy of arms comprising 22 pump action rifle, 19 den guns, and six machetes. Other items recovered include, include assorted mobile phones, SIM card monitors, or SIM card, uh, SIM card monitor. Okay, SIM cards, sorry, comma, monitor and laptop one operational helix vehicle and various booty items and charms i want you to remember let me remind you this you remember when nelly said you kill our men and you put fulani juju on their waist you kill our men and you place fulani juju on their waist that was what nelly of Ebu said now it is a confirmation that all these insecurities that is in the Afra land across is Nelly Ofebu that is living in California. She is living in California, United States, and a Berima in Finland that is living in uh, Helsinki, in Finland. Those are the people that are perpetrating all these atrocities, and Oyibo uh, living in the USA. Those are the people that are, you know, perpetrating all the atrocities happening in Biafra land. Are you paying attention? And I'm also talking to the channel TV, not whatever, you know, these security operatives, their easy way out is to say ESN and IPOB. And we've been debunking that there are people who are dressing like ESN and IPOB, being led by the man, you know, the boy in Finland, being led by this girl in, in the USA. And they are among others. They are the people that is bringing atrocities in Biafra land. We've been telling you guys, but you guys does not pay attention. All you people always want is to go out there to report nonsense, to report junk all over the place. That's what you media houses do, does in this Biafra land. Once they, they tell you this is how it is, making your journey, making your journey, uh, you know, easy. They are making your, you know, life easy. Because they know that you, Media House, you're not ready to investigate. You're not ready to do anything. That is the reason why they will present to you lies. And you write junk and place on a public domain. I don't expect this. You know. Now, let me continue the reading. One operational helix vehicle, voodoo items and charms were also recovered. The arms spokesman initiated, un, or, or sorry, initiated. Okay, the arms spokesman initiated, which means you took the result or the report from arms statement. You did not go out there to conduct your further investigation, and you come and present junk. Arms statement will always point it to be, for you to believe that they are investigative. Nothing is investigative in Nigeria. They will always find an easy way out to label their criminality on another person. The people committing this crime, the people committing this crime, it is Nelly Ofebu Idu. You hear her voice, Nelly Ofebu Idu, and her boy, Eberimade, that is living in Helsinki, in Finland. Those are the people committing this crime. 
Nobody else. Nobody else. Let us continue. These are not ESN. We, are said, we have said it over and over again. Our gallant men are in the bushes. Our gallant men are not enforcers of any seat at home. These are, you know, at, you know, activities of some politicians using some of the expelled members of IPOB in order to try to sabotage IPOB. These are the people that are committing all these atrocities in Biafra land. Let us continue. Now, they say they went ahead and say, now let me now shock you. Let me now shock you. According to him, according to this military spokesperson or whatever spokesperson who was enunciating, according to him, the investigation revealed that the hideout served as the operational base of one innocent Obieke. Innocent Obieke. Did you hear that? AKA Double Lion. <laughs> Dear friends, did you hear that? Now, before we proceed, let us go back. Let us go back to this. Let us go back to this before we proceed with this one. Let us go back to this so that you will understand exactly what we are saying. Because when, when we are talking, you will think we are bluffing. This is the reason why they keep telling you Soludo, Soludo. This is the reason why they keep telling you Soludo this, Soludo that. Let me shock you. Let me shock you. Let me, let me now show Channel TV where the, um, the syndicate, you know, they are actually confirming what they did. When the syndicate or the leader of the syndicate is actually confirming her activities with these boys you people are looking for. So that you will say, you will not tell them you will not tell the public that it is ESN. ESN does not enforce it at home. ESN does not take people cars. ESN does not go about with your hoodoo voodoo. Uh, ESN does not carry living houses. ESN does not have a home where you call it a base. ESN, they operate in the walls and in the bushes. They are not terrorists. They are not criminals. Anybody that you see parading themselves in the name of ESN, kidnapping people, causing cannibalism, you must know that, that it is politically, you know, you know, you know, motivated. Politically motivated. You should shoot, shoot people. Those people, you should shoot them to kill because they are criminals. We are sensitizing and sanitizing our land. We are sensitizing our land and we are telling you guys that these people, they are not part of us. So you should go ahead, investigate these people, deal with them decisively because they are not part of us. Our people are disciplined. I want you to see their head who is actually controlling them. You will hear from her. Listen attentively. Channel TV, all of you got her media in the in the, in the, in that Nigeria, so that you stop taking your news from this uh, police military. They will find a soft landing for themselves. They will always find easy way out, so that it will for them to prove their competency. But all of them are incompetent. Listen and listen attentively. Okay. Okay. 
Did you hear that? I hope you heard where what we were reading. They said um, they call him AKA. Let me you know highlight the place where you are going to see. You see where the the highlight is. That is exactly the boy of Nelly that rebelled against Nelly that now started asking questions the activities of Nelly and what she is sending them to do and the activities of a Finland and what she is he, they are sending them to do now they turn against him they now handed them over and tell these people to say it is the you know it, it is ESN now listen to the person who sent these people when she you know after she sent them to die after she sent them and they now exposed them she now come to the media Run to the media as if you know it is who's a Now, listen, Lion, I'm going to start with you. Did you see these people brought these people out where they are doing a great job, promised them heaven on earth, you know. Now today they have, you know, those are, you know, Nelly Ofebu was, you know, was a member of IPOB. When we discovered that Nelly Ofebu is not just a, you know, he didn't come to support this discipline movement. Nelly Ofebu came because she is a politician and because we are not supporting the activities of politicians so that they want to use her to destroy IPOB from inside. From there, Nelly Ofebu got some information. Today, Nelly Ofebu decided to rebel and he is a, she is expelled member of IPOB. She is not a member of IPOB and will never be a member of IPOB. She now went out there, you know, to rebel against IPOB. She now went out there to form a criminals, give them the same, you know, uniform of um, ESN, give them the same, you know, almost the same oppression as ESN. But the only thing that she gave them that the ESN is not doing enforcement of sit at home killing people, cannibalism, and all this high, you know, stealing people, cars. The ESN are in the bush. They don't come to the town. They are there fighting and protecting our walls from the insurgence of terrorism. That's where our ESN are. So the ones you see trying to enforce it at home, trying to enforce whatever they are enforcing, these are common criminal, politically, you know, motivated. Politically motivated. Nelly Ofebu is a member of PDP. Nelly Ofebu is a member of PDP. In case if you are not, you are doubting me, let me show you who Nelly Ofebu is. She is a member of PDP. I hope you see her in front of your screen. That is Nelly Ofebu so that you will understand exactly what is going on. Nelly Ofebu is not IPOB. The people she is working with is not IPOB. She bring them to destroy the name of ESN. That is the reason why she send them to go and be, you know, kidnapping, killing people, doing all these things, wearing the same uniform as ESN. You know what is called, you know, well, I call it prejudice. It is part of prejudice. What Nelly Ofebu did or what Nelly Ofebu is doing, she and the Remind Finland, I will call it, call it prejudice. 
because now they are using a brand, you know, to sabotage that brand. They are using the branding of a particular group of people in order to, you know, they are creating a parallel, just like Hope Uzodem Masai, a parallel, you know, criminals. They are creating a criminals to counter ESN. Now they have, they will have to dress these criminals like ESN, so that every of the atrocities these criminals, you know, you know, get themselves involved with, it will go down to become that it is ESN because they know it is the only way to destroy ESN and destroy IPOB. That is exactly what Nelly Ofebu is doing. And that is the reason why she is shouting on top of her voice after setting the boys that is working with her up. She set them up because they're now asking too many questions. They're now, you know, trying to understand what is going on. She set them up. And now the, your so-called military man is now are telling you, Channel TV, that the, these are ESN. Now, these are ESN, easy way out. Listen to know who are those people. Listen to know who those people are working for. They are working for Nelly Ofebu Eberima Simon in Finland. Nelly Ofebu is in California, United States. Simon is in Helsinki, um, Finland. Did you see now where she sell herself out? Where she blow her cover? Did you see now where she proof all this your junk media house is wrong? You know, a criminal will keep running their mouth. They will actually incriminate themselves. This is where she, she actually make all of you writing junk, saying it is ESN and IPOB. Listen to it. She's now asking these guys that she already set up when last did you work with this IPOB, which is IPOB, China Samoru, Kano Takano, because they are no longer part of these people. Why are you now asking questions about these people? They were manipulated to, you know, to move away from these people. Now, when they realize that what they are doing is, you know, contrary to what, you know, they are assigned to do, they start asking questions. You know, they start comparing in order to see if they will be able to know the truth. But they don't realize they have crossed the Rubicon. As long as you are men on the ground, once you go south, you are not going home. Once you go south, you're not going home. That is the oath that you have taken. Listen. Okay. Now she said that, you know, Lion Lion is trying to, you know, make it look as if the IPOB knows what is their activities. That's what she said, know what is going on in the bushes. That is their activities. Of course, we don't know their activities. They are not part of us. And that is the reason why I, take, I took it upon myself to make you understand that these are common criminal, politically motivated, that are, you know, and that is the reason why this woman, you know, but let us continue before I say what I want to say. Who said, who said to be, okay, double, his name is AKA Double Lion. You heard it from Nelu. He said to be the head of the vigilante group in the area, but you know, surreptitiously coordinates the criminals' activities of IPOB in the area. Now, listen to what they said. That Lion Lion says, okay, Lion Lion, you know, who said to be the head of the vigilante group in the area which means 
Okay. Which means Nelly Ofebu, when she is setting these people up, when she was setting them up, she told them that they, these people are portraying themselves to be like a vigilante, but they are doing the activities of IPOB ESN because that is exactly the reason why these people were formed. But the little the, these people know that you know they can even be a victim amongst you know the oppression. The reason why I say they can be a victim, it doesn't mean if they are shot to be killed, if they are dead, as long as they are sabotaging ESN, that their life does not matter. They have given their lives in the palms of Nelly Ofebu and Ibrahim Fernand. That is exactly what the orientation is. That is the reason why Nelly Ofebu is now telling you all these things she is telling you. Because the people you see out there, they must act as if they are ESN in order to sabotage ESN. If they die, it does not matter. As long as they do, you know, they do their operation, their activities, their assignment. Now they have, rea they, when they realize, no, this is not what we are supposed to be doing. Start asking questions. She called a Eke. She called the cops on them. She called the military on them to kill all of them because their life does not matter. All that matters is the assignment. That is the only thing that matters. So now they portray to be like a you know vigilante group in the area, but you know surreptitiously coordinated the criminal activities of IPOB in the area. This is not they are, uh, you know, they are coordinating the criminal activities of them. You should ask them which syndicate are they belonging to. Daily, daily media house. Ask them which, which, which people, which organization are they referring? Are, do they belong? They will tell you they belong to you. Do autopilot. Ask them very well if they are not. Beat them if you have them in your possession. Beat them up. Ask them, ask them who are they representing. Because they are not representing IPOB ESN. We don't do crime. And the earlier you people know it, the, the better for you. Chuku Kikabi Ama own up. Gotha Media House. Now, General Wachuku said the suspect is currently on the run. Which means the double lion escaped. Double lion escaped. That is the reason why Nelly is screaming, why did they not kill double lion? She is now screaming that you must go and dress, go and, you know, seek for spiritual advice, you know, or spiritual uh, um, whatever, so that you will know that your life, you're already dead. Because Nelly have mount, mount those security operatives that she is working with. Now, whenever any of you realize what you are doing, she will use them to take you out. They are on your tail, double lion. When she is saying, double lion. That's what Nelly said. And if you think about it, that is the truth. There is no two ways about it. Because General Wachuku, okay. General Wachuku said the suspect is currently on the run. Why the troops have intensified operation to close him on to close in on him and his cohort. He urged members of the general public to continue to support troops and other security agencies with the credible and timely information that will lead to the arrest of the of criminal elements in their vicinity. Are you paying attention? So that is how it is. This is what Nelly or Febu have done with our men. Now, when you look in front of your screen, this is the type of a gun Nelly or Febu gave to this man. This is the type of you know phones, laptop, all these things. This is their you know they will be watching. You see the the um, Android phones there. Where they will be watching when they are when their cabals are broadcasting, when their when their syndicate leaders are broadcasting, 
You see the laptop and all these uh, these things. They'll be watching them taking commands. That is it. That is them. Now they have asked question. They set them up. <laughs> That is the same fate waiting for you all men on the ground. If you decide that you want to rebel and follow the enemy in the name of them brainwashing you, the fate of these people is going to come to you. When you are a man on the ground, once you go south, you must understand that you are not going home. You are under oath to protect our walls, to protect our lands, to protect our people. You are under command and control. So if you are not given a command, you do not move. So if you take command to some, from somebody out there, from politician, from DSS, from Nelly of Fable, from Berima uh, Simon, Joko, all of them, it means that you have gone south and you will never go home. Because Fabru Kutegnuzo, According to how your mistress said it to you. Now there is a news that I also saw here. While I was moving. Police. Now let us see that news also. Police foil attacked by suspected IPOB members. In Imo State. Remember, okay, before we go there, before we go there, let me bring to you this. Before we go there, let me bring to you this. Because I want to bring to you this a video. This message is for Charles Tukuma Saludo, the new slave servant in Anambra State. Mm -hmm. The sons of Edomite. <laughs> Let me correct that uh, fake history they keep presenting to you. Let me correct that history. That the people she calls the Edomite. Because these people, they keep presenting to you fake history. They are not historic. You know, they, they have never studied history. Even if they did, they study archaeological history, history of you know 400 years ago. That's what they have studied there because they call them um, doctor. Now let me tell you, Mel your fable and your the people you are brainwashing. The same way you bring your idu to brainwash our people before we proceed, because we deal on matter arise arising immediately. Number one, I want to inform you that the Edomites are the Europeans. <laughs> Edomites are the Europeans. When you read the book of Genesis 25, the Genesis 25, 25, it says the first of them came out red. The first of them came out red. And he was called Esau. Edomites are like our cousins, but they are rebellious against God. They were called, which is the Europeans. Europeans are our cousin. In case if you are not aware, if you want to open the book of Genesis 25, you open it. Let me teach you a little bit of history because they will teach you all this archaeological nonsense. They will use to deceive all of you because they know you will not find out. They feed you with lies. You know, now let me open it so that there is something I want to show you. If you have King James, open the book of Genesis 25. Let us learn history. Book of Genesis 25. Let us just use two minutes or three minutes.
to reflect on that so that you will know that everything that nelly or fable and cohorts they are feeding you it is all a lie and propaganda listen I want to get the word, you know, the way it is written. That is the reason why I am opening it. The way it is written. The precept is too much. You, you know, you cannot. Okay, now let's go to Genesis 25. Okay, let me start from 23, then you will understand. And the Lord said unto her, Two nations are in thy womb, and two manner of people shall be separated from thy bowels. The Lord is talking to Rebekah, the, the, the wife of Isaac. And the one people shall be strong than the other people, and the elder shall serve the younger. <laughs> are you paying attention? What is what we are preaching now? Because of the Nelly said that the how much did you collect from the Edomite? Because she does not know who are the Edomites. Fulanis are not the Edomites. Fulanis are in the you know, Ishmael lineage. Let me, verse 24, verse 24. And when her days to be delivered were fulfilled, behold, they were twins in her womb. And the first came out red, all over like a hairy garment. Ajibwajuyanalu, Esau. And they called his name Esau, Esau, E-S-A-U, Esau. And after that came his brother out, and his hand took hold on Esau's heel, and his name was called Jacob. And Isaac was three score years old when she was when she when he she bared them. And the boys grew, and Esau was cunning. Esau was cunning, and daughter, daughter, they are very, very cunning. Oh, you go, man. They, they, Esau was cunning. C U N C U N N N N I N G C U N I N G. Esau was cunning. You know, do you know the type of cunning when we talk about cunning? It is talking about manipulatives. They are manipulators. They will use psychological approach to destroy you. That is cunning. Now, Esau was, was cunning hunter and a man of the field. And Jacob was plain man dwelling in a tent. Our people. Our people, we are plain dwelling in a tent. We are plain dwelling in a tent. And Isaac loved Esau because he did eat of his vengeance. But Rebekah loved Jacob, the power of a woman. And Jacob sought pottage. And Esau came from the field and he was faint. And Esau said to Jacob, feed me, I pray thee, with the same red pottage, for I am faint. Therefore, was his name called Edom. Was his name called Edom. Edomite. Edoms, Edomite, Edomias. They are all the same. And his name was called the Edom. So, the Edoms are the Europeans. They are not you know, they, they came out red according to the, you know, the history of it. They came, he came out red. So when Nelly is going about giving you false, you know, false, you know, teaching in the name of a doctor, PhD holder, who does not know, you know, what is going on, she come feeding you lies. You should stop listening to this woman's manipulation. Listen. You have to tell us what you did for them that made you the new slave in Anambra State. Mm -hmm. So no, the very soon, the whole world will know what you did. What you did. So no, the Igwe Ejiri. Ejiri. So no, the Ejiri. But I don't know what you did. 
when I was actually opening so that you will you will understand it. This message is for Charles Chukwuoma Soludo, mm -hmm. the new slave servant in Anambra State. Pay attention. That slave they just brought to Anambra State. Soludo, I hope you can hear me. Chukwuoma Soludo, I hope you can hear me. Let me tell you, a time will come. Soludo, I, I have your book of many chapters. Mm -hmm. Soludo, a time will come when you will tell the people what favor you did to the caliphate, what favor you did to the uncircumcised, what favor you did to the son for the sons of Edomites. Mm -hmm. You have to tell us the favor. The sons of Edomite, she just opened her mouth to run it like a tap water without knowing what she is blabbering. You know, that is by the way, I have I have given you exactly who are the Edomites. You know, now the reason why they started telling you Soludo this, Soludo that, Soludo, it is because it is under the regime. They saw to you that this military exercise was Anambara Enugu, uh, sorry, Anambara and the Imo. That's how you know some of these Nellis men get caught up, and some of them were killed. That is the reason why Nelly is crying. Maybe some of the you know the ones that are not yet corrupted were killed, were caught up in this thing. That is the reason why Nelly is crying here now. Nelly is crying because her men, her men on the ground died. If I must tell you, remember that the nine she killed before, before she started raising funds, the, she killed nine. She said that the military went home with 2,000 body back, but nine men, she lost nine men, the ones she killed before. Now she killed these ones that you heard that she's been talking about, calling their names in the in quest to kill double lion. In the quest to kill double lion. She killed this man. Now let us continue because Double Lion is the one who is asking questions. You know, maybe they are not giving Double Lion what they're supposed to be. They're giving Double Lion. Double Lion asked them questions. They set him up. Now let us continue to read. There is an article that I want to show you. Let us finalize reading it. Our line is actually open now. Our line is open if you want to call in. Police in Imo State on Sunday foil an attack by armed men suspected to be members of the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra, ESN, Eastern Security Network. In a statement, police spokesperson C CSP Michael Abatam said the militia wing of the IPOB came in their number from the rear of Oboe Division, which is an uncovered forest through petrol bombs and improvised explosives devices that fell on the transit camp and a vehicle shooting sporadically. CSP Abatam further narrated that the police operatives of the division and some of the command command's tactical team responded swiftly, engaging the government in a fierce gun duel preventing them from gaining entrance to the station and in the process force the hoodlums into retreating. Okay, four suspected. Okay, now the reason why you will see all these things now is that because Nelly, Simon and all of them, autopilot you do, they are now committing atrocities with these people. They are walking on the ground trying to destroy the name of ESN. But when they are reporting it, they will not tell you that this is politically, you know, motivated. This is politically motivated. They won't tell you because my, you know, these people, Nigeria, the enemy of IPOB. DSS, the enemy of IPOB, using some of the expelled members of IPOB 
you know, in order to attack IPOB, in order to label IPOB bad guys. That's what they are doing. And, you know, we have come here to debunk them. Now, trying to understand it, for you to know that Mazen Namdekan warned us, if you remember this, he warned us about these people. He warned us very much about these people and their activities. Deception and manipulation. Yes. Want to come in? You can come in. Let me send the link before we proceed. I am sending the link. If you want to come in, you can come in. If you want to call, direct call, you can do so because we are moving forward. If you want to give us a direct call, you can go for it. Of course, we have given you the way it is. We have given it to you the way it is. For you to know that anything with regards to autopilot you do and their cohort, they are all, you know, criminals. They are all infiltrators. They are all there to sabotage the work and activities of IPOB. They are all there to make sure that they give bad name to IPOB. And that is what they do. That is what they will keep doing. Because now let me play to the zoo and the media, gutter media houses, you know, our people's voice, our men's voice. Let me play it to you. Uh, the voice of our men that are on the ground for you to know that what you are busy chasing after is the autopilot you do, man. Listen, that is the reason why we tell everybody, draw the line that you will... Uh, 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 autopilot. Mm -hmm. The word of autopilot, he does not know the activities of autopilot. That's what he is saying. We are having a first caller. I am going to call you. We are going to take this call. We are having a first call. Let us listen to the, the caller on the line, your name and where you are calling from. You have two and a half minutes. I'll make it quick. Thank you. Good afternoon, uh, Judge Money. Uh, my name is Marian Ada. Uh, and I'm calling from Maryland in the United States. I'm going to be quick, like I said. I just want to compliment and commend you for a job well executed. Um, one or two things I want to bring out from that crazy woman and her cohort. The, what she's using is deception. And there are key words. She's using projection, deception, and manipulation. Yes. When she invoked, but there were questions you asked. Why do they always, at the end, they invoke Mazi's name? That is when they are being deceptive because they still want to confuse, manipulate their followers. So they must bring in Mazi's name to continue to, for those people to continue to follow them like what is following their mother. Yeah. Number two, they have, you hear him invoke Elohim or begin to quote Bible, Bible verses, even when she's not familiar with them. The angle on that one is draw. She's throwing like uh, when you throw a bone to the dog, the dog continues to follow you. Or there was no need to go to the beginning and get on this. Something like that. So that is the ego she's throwing at them. Because I can guarantee you, if you do a story, of the 80 to 90 percent, if not 99 percent, of the people that are following them or they're using manipulating, even the, the so called fake ESM, whether they were before with ESM, but for them to leave and follow them is be, these people are those that are into religiosity. 
I'm not talking about being going to church or being a religious person because you can be a religious a person of faith that you wouldn't really just sit in. No, so she has believers. to be doing that to continue to prove them, you know. So there are key words she's using there. And deception here is, you see, she will come and begin to act like she may have one or two issues with Bridget, but She's invoking Mazi's name because she has to present her. Now, two, two things are playing here again projection and deception. Yes. Mazi is going to come out. Final, because it's obvious to them they were not able to kill him in Kenya. Yeah. It's obvious to them Mazi is likely to come out. So she's playing a double game here. Oh, that's why she's saying, oh, what has Mazi done to you? You want to kill him? Meanwhile, she's the one doing it. Now she's trying to defend yes. herself. Like said, My sister, you are very, very intelligent. You are very, very intelligent. I wish I can have you in a program. You are very, very intelligent. Uh, maybe sometime if you say, I can at least my name, you know, even though it's not my profession, but I'm, I'm an analyst. I have the mind of criminals, so I can analyze your part. But anyway. <laughs> no, we have to make it happen. Anyway, you must run out the one of the days. I'm going to supply you to that at the end of the day, what she's trying to, I hope, now I'm going to speak directly. To those who are following them, I want to give them a piece of advice. Yes. Let them see what this woman and uh, what is it called? And um Simon are doing. Mm -hmm. They use them to gain whatever they want because they are using them to do the bits of the Nigerian and that the one getting the money. But yeah. when the heat is on, they dump them and run away from the kitchen. Yes. These guys should start following them. That's my direct advice to them. If only they can hear me and listen to me. Please, these who don't care about your life, your life do, do not matter to them. Yeah. To you, they are, you are, to them, you are just an object they are using to get the ends, which is justifies their it means, which is whatever money they want to get or political aspiration they have. They are trying to use to create mayhem. Chaos. Everything they are doing, because of them, Umai is part of them. And all these rejected idiots that left and have personal hatred for Mars, these are the ones doing this beast with the Nigerian government. So there are no two ways about it. Everybody, all these people who have been thinking that these people were accusing them for nothing, this exposure today is a seal, a thumb on me to prove that this Mary, but this Nari, Mary, I want to say, she may have a, I believe she has a mental disease. Undiagnosed, I believe that. But she knows what she's doing. She knows what she's doing. She's playing a game. She's trying to control the narrative. That's why she's doing this. And remember... Mazi C2. Yes, Mazi George Money. Yeah, come in, come in, come in. We, even though we are not live, this has been... This is a, a replay of a program. So... Oh, uh, is it a play? It is a replay. It is a replay. Okay. Uh, but uh, I think our people can hear us anyway. Yes, they can. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, I don't. Uh, I appreciate you, my brother. You know the. Um, you know your broadcast every day. Uh, when you put it out there, it's a, um, it's something everybody wants to listen to. Uh, and then it's like uh, something you just did newly. So um. You know, it's it's one in a million, and then uh, I appreciate our people that is listening at the moment. Thank Believe you. me, I thank you, Mazi George, for your good job that you are doing. I appreciate every IPOB uh, media warrior. You guys have done a very good job to Bia France. You have, uh, you know, enlightened our people to understand um, that um, these people call um, infiltrators. And Samanepa and uh, his gangs, they have done a lot of mayhem to our people in Biafra land. Believe you me. <laughs> These people will never go, they will never go, they will never go scot free. I keep saying it and I'll be saying it. They will never go scot free because 
Samara Batinki, he can jump up and down wherever he is in Helsinki, in Finland, you know, drinking his cup of tea, coming out in one two by two room and start yapping rubbish all the time. Samara, but when the due time come, he will pay for his crime. Um, I don't know. Uh, I don't know if you see the post of um, in the Raptor Media today, where Maze uh, Okitku uh, posted uh, the people that still post out today. I don't know if you've seen the the, the pictures. Um, I think I haven't seen it. I think I have to check. Yeah, check it right. Uh, Rapture media and post it to our people to see. There's there's current one where they busted them today. I think Soludo busted them, you know, uh, uh today. I think if it's today or yesterday, oh, I have I saw it. Mazo, yes, yes. So you need to put it here so that our people can see it. So what we have been shouting about, Samaneba and Nelly and uh, Oibo and uh, Charles and other things. The thing is. The, the, what they're trying to do is to form a gang where they can use it to threaten Mazen Namdekane when he comes out. We know this. And they want to use it for political talk. The highest builder take it all. So that uh, Samaneba will stay in, uh, in Finland where he can be issuing a threat. And I have challenged him to move out from Finland. And I, will, I am saying it clear. Any IPOB that says Samaneba should take him down. He does not want to be he does not want to leave believe you me this guy have caused a lot of mayhem in biafra land thinking because he's in europe he can uh, stay in his room and be talking rubbish but i was watching uh was sophia you know when we are telling our people that um that some never want to overthrow Mazen Namdekano with his uh, uh, his brokers and his uh, atrocity. Their plan was to overshadow Mazen Namdekano. We know this. We know exactly where he's going. But they have failed. And he has failed woefully. And he knows that. Some cannot come to do his stupid expose without bringing uh, Umada because he has nothing to offer anymore. On an Amazia GDD, he has to bring Umada to speak for him. He's a coward. Yeah. I challenge him to, to leave uh, uh, Finland and move out wherever he is. He's nobody. He knows that he's nobody. It's just unfortunately that uh, uh, he came closer to Mazen Namdekano. That is what pissed me off. I don't know how he managed to come closer to our leader by uh, interviewing our leader. That mistake has been done. Believe you me, Biafrans will never do that mistake again. From what IPOB have passed through for the past, getting to one year now, we can never do that mistake again. Onyo sokraya wuro. Eni bodo sokraya wuro ne lo wa. Onyo sokraya wuro wuro American president. Before you come closer to IPOB and Mazen Nam Dekano, you must go through screaming. We must scream you and know your background and know where you are coming from. Because we have come to uh, liberate our people from the hands of this ginger wheel. You know what pisses me off is this. Look at our gallant men that were supposed to stay by, uh, stand by and wait for the, you know, for the proper time. Because there must be a, a war in Nigeria. They are just pretending. Everybody knows that. Fulani has been coming. They are not hiding it. They have been showing it the handwriting that they are come to uh, conquer. They said Nigeria belongs to them. They are not hiding it now. They want to take over. But you know what pisses me off is that our men that are supposed to guide our land, that were supposed to stand in the front line, are the ones are the ones their lives have been cut short because of uh, Samaneba and Nelly and uh, Bridget and um, uh, Rabbi Charles and uh, all these criminals in America. You know, deceiving our people. When Mazi was there, all these things is not happening. They took advantage because Mazi Namdekano was uh, kidnapped and they took advantage to be doing all this rubbish. But time shall tell. You know, uh, Mazi, a lot of things have gone wrong. A lot of things have gone wrong. Believe you me. This guy came out in social media, start attacking Mazi Namdekano structure. Start, uh, you know, position himself to become the next leader. Uwasofia have said it today, uh, uh, yesterday, their program they made, that uh, when you see 
a gangs of criminal one of them are confessing these are the things they have in their mind despite they are all these people are autopilot now these people are useless to do these are their what you remember when he said that uh, sam never know what he's doing he will change his platform to do you remember when he said he, he yes. made that so uh, do you think uh, he made that comment uh because uh he just made it the agenda was this let's destroy ipob and let's float up we do so i never think that when ipob is destroyed or proscribed or whatever they feel that they want to achieve and he will be you know championing you do you know uh putting on people as he do and uh you know uh, you know trying to make uh, see if he do is the free people now but we know all this you know that is what we are telling our people if you are living you know most of our people in, in biafra land are, are more educated than these fools that live in europe you will see somebody that live in europe you'll be asking yourself where did this person you'll be asking yourself i think this man is living in europe we say that uh, uh there's an adage in our place said that uh on your um how do they put it again i say on your uh, uh, uh how do they put that adage again oh, yeah, then, then I go and say, oh, yeah, ma. exactly you know so them that had they have travel they can't even read the handwriting on the wall but let me make it clear these are the people that was attacking mazen americano when he was uh broadcasting anytime you see him broadcasting they will come these are the same people gang of uh all these bunk criminals that think that ipob is where they can make money go and check after the after uh the amalgamation of nigeria and the civil uh war we call genocide against our people and full any form of Hanese for us, all, all group, Kuniaki, Kenga, all these things was formed by Fulani. They cannot speak in one voice. That is where you see this uh Igbo World Congress. Those ones are those ones are uh, uh, how do I put them? Those ones are a bunch of confused people, bunch of useless, confused people. They stay in America. America is a country where you can go and learn a lot of things, but they don't learn no nothing. All they, what they learn is to eat hamburger and cheese. That is what they learn. They can come, look at, you can see something that will happen. Other people will make a statement, but they, them themselves that we are, they should scrap that Igbo World Congress. There is nothing like Igbo World Congress. These are a bunch of hyenas. These are a bunch of, you know, hyenas that cannot hunt. You know, never will. They are a bunch of scavengers. I hope America can make a law one day and chase them out from and, and, and ban them. Chase them out. These are these are useless set of idiots. One UDPP was asking Maz, what passport do you come here with? He cannot even travel to his father's land now. Idiot. Look at them. You know, some these people think they know. Our people, some of our people think they know, but they know no nothing. Believe you me, ever since Mazi came out, I begin to reason that uh, I begin to see that I think they said that indeed we won't them. Not only they, just like me and you now, oh, proper Igbo people. Where well, Igbo people speak, you know, they will not all this full and ginger we blood. When you tell them the truth that your blood is contaminated, they will think that we are joking. Their blood are contaminated. These are not Igbo people. The Igbo people I know, Hana, 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 Janja, when you when they talk to you they you know what they mean not this uh fraud no no uh kuli kuli bunch of asanidi bonem any day they I enter listen to that to sofia what she said to simon let me remove her from the 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 screen because she's not worth being in front of our screen no, nah, this one is just a bunch of. Uh, Samwepa is not stupid. He know what he's doing. Samwepa is the person that starts this history teller. If it is a lie, go back. Samwepa start with Igodomigodo history, which is he do history. So Samwepa know what he's doing. He's not stupid. Don't worry, Samwepa will change that in page when our people have no who they are. He will change it to a do. Go and mark it. I'm telling you today. It's not. 
Unless here from so that is it. Um the video you were talking about. This yeah, one... this is the current video, yeah. We we'll play it yeah. for our people to see what is happening. These are the people that uh, Nelly or uh, and Samaneba is uh, recruiting. These are his criminals that I are went. But I want you to pay attention to this. Yeah. This is the criminals, the hoodlums, the infiltrators that they are in our land, kidnapping people. But most important, I want you all to just pay attention. I mean, the environment. Just pay attention to the environment. Okay, my good people. So those are the um, the busted uh, criminals today. Um, yes, was these, are yesterday. These, are some, never these are his boys. Yes. The environment's yeah. most important that you pay attention to that started environment. That is something that you have to understand. When the video ends, I will tell you what it's all about. Just pay attention and listen very carefully. They are hoodlums. They are kidnappers. Those people that are causing problems in Biafra land, forcing people to sit at home by force. Now you will understand. Pay attention. They even have a shrine in their in their camp. They, they have everything. Marcy. Yeah. You can hear the language. Post it there. Post it there first. Are you listening? Okay. I hope you are paying attention very well. Pay attention well to that environment. You can hear the language of that uh, man that is speaking. These are not these are not Nigeria security. This man is not from uh, uh, Yoruba or Hausa or Igbera or Tifi or Benue or whatever or Plateau or Kaduna or whatever. These are pure Niger security uh, security men because uh, Soludo have no mouth. Whatever they bring for him, that is what he's going to take. Look at that language that man is speaking. These are Arab. These are uh, these people from Niger and Mali. Look at his language. They are in our land, killing our people. The, the boys that were supposed to, we keep standby to wait. When Fulani bring this war, we give it to them. But uh, Samaneba, because of his envy and jealous, he wants to become leader. He went and used IPOB money, ESM money, he am Nelly and Madam uh, and all these rabbits and uh, all these criminals, which their death will be imminent. Only the Buddhist people. Oh, oh. I am not hiding mouth to say it. They know. Look at uh, our young boys. Samanapa is wasting them. Whichever one you see, the ones they are giving hundred, uh, hundred, uh, one million, two million. But the ones that are driving jeeps, these are the guys that will leave this area now. This tattered area. They will go to somewhere else and cause mayhem. These are the boys that is um, when they see any woman that is fry akara, they will throw away his akara, and uh, you know, uh, in, probably injure the woman and and tell her go go and sit at home. When they see one in a rogue, they will beat the woman mercilessly, carry her back to and go and sell. Look at the area they are staying, and they cause mayhem. Whoever they kidnap their own people again. And they go, it seems that these people, these people deserve to leave. My anger, when Mazi was here, all these things are not happening. It happens because Samaneba and Eleli use the money that meant for ESM to be, you know, they suffer it and they use it to be grooming these criminals, these young boys, which did not know anything. Agrono, yes. And the problem now is that now that Simon Eba and Nelly now are fighting each other, who is in control of those boys? Uh, no, but that, exactly. No, but not is, pilot now. The, the money is not coming. That is why they are kidnapping. Yes. They are on autopilot now, the boys. Be, because you can't tell me somebody from Enugu uh, where uh, Nelly came, we love to, we, we, we love Simon. No, they will hate him because. He have disgraced their sister in social media by spreading his nude. 
Some of the mm. guys that they work together now, in Enugu, they will become enemy. This one, we're going to be pointing this one. This one, we're going to be you pointing know, the, this one. The, the, the reason why I played I, I play this broadcast that I played now, I played this uh, evening, is because when they talk, when Simon talk about uh, him being a group of his intelligence who who were involved in the creating of this uh, other and criminal of uh, of a thing and their M branch, I want I want to remind our people that Simon and Nelly, whoever they are using, they are all use they are all in it together. Because if you look at the lion, lion, and the ones they've been calling, the ones that have fallen, will you be investigating someone and they killing your people, uh, the same people you say they are intelligentsia? How can you be investigating Nelly, bringing the intelligent people to die because of Nelly? Yeah, yeah, that, 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 that is the thing. Now, it will become so... It will, it will become... More deadly now, Marzi, because the people that uh, are from Samaneba place that they work with Nelly play because they all join together. People from Enugu, people from Ebony. Now so they will divide themselves. They will run away because this one want to point where these people are. Uh, are. This one want to give information because now Samaneba and the Nelly is fighting. So those gangs have been separated. Now they will be fighting themselves. These are the things. Uh, this is where I feel pain. This is what Samaleba calls in our land. Samaleba wants to become a king. He wants to become, uh, he wants to overthrow Marcel Namdekan, but he wants to be known. He wants no, to become. think that we are, doing, we are doing autonomous Igwe here. That autonomous is what he thought. That's exactly what he thought. This is our boys that were supposed to, uh, you know, stay by, st stand by. And watch when Fulani will bring war to us. We, we, we watch them. Now they are dying in the same house of the Fulani. Because if you see this, these people that are speaking now, are uh, not even Nigeria. Uh, uh, child, um, child Amalia. Look at that Look at that uh, security man that is speaking. Does he look like... Because this is an Arab. This is how they speak. This are yeah. this an Arab people. They will bring it to Solu. They has no mouth to... <laughs> To, to say, no, I don't want these people. Whatever they give him, that is what he's going to take. And you know that these people hate us. And you know that they want anything that we bring the woman down. They want it. This are yeah. the, Without Opruna, if someone ever will stop his menace, if he did not interfere in what IPOB is doing, trying to show himself in social media that he can be only one man that can fight IPOB, all these things will not be happening. Our people will still be, will still be looking after each other. Oh, everybody in the one year looking after each other, but now they have divided now because wherever their gang is, these are the things that is happening. Yes, yes, look at now, where these boys are. Now, they will be on autopilot, the real autopilot, of course, there will be you no know, leader, you know. Hey, Nelly will be trying to hunt uh, the Abakleke people uh, once, and Abakleke once with Simon will try to be hunting Enugu people because now they have divided. They have yeah. bring mayhem into our land, which is this is where I feel pain. This is where border. This is where one then I lose one uh, one New York. This is where my concern is. Our people that Mazi have put in place. Everybody put a get one watching they know when you hear what Chineke, they know I hear what Chineke from, from the mouth of the people I cannot even 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 believe. When you hear what Chineke, you know what it means. You don't need to, you don't need somebody to tell you. Look at it now. Yes. Look at this mayhem. The full are, are, are using this opportunity that Samaneba and Nelly created in our land to be killing our boys. Yes. Yeah. They're using this opportunity. Are you going to blame them? Because we want Samaneba of this rubbish he he came on social media. He came out one day and said that Chuko uh, uh, Kabiyama tell him all the uh, commanders of ESM from him to Chuko Kabiyama that uh, whatever, whatever, that uh, there's something he made there at one certain time. I keep looking at this guy and say, who is this guy? This is someone who don't. You know, when we talk, 
people will think uh, Samaneba is uh, on top or you know what he's doing. Samaneba, I said, I told you one day that this guy is not on I can share Gabri, I can share Abni on. He's not sleeping. Nice. I I tell Samaneba, the best thing you can do for yourself, go and drink, go and drink acid and die, or hang yourself. Because I feel with Ataka, it will be worse. It's best thing for you, go and drink acid. You hang yourself. Kenelly <laughs> will that an Arab or Nelly, listen. The people that say that Nelly is sick, Nelly is not sick. She know what is Nelly is normal, but one on a line appear totally. The same way Samaneba, you see, when Samaneba open his mouth to speak, he contradict himself. Anything, any day he open his mouth to speak, our ancestors is tormenting him. Yes. There is no word that comes out from his mouth. I, I sometimes ask myself, this guy after finishing his broker, does he go back to see to? to to listen to himself he contradicts you know these are the era these are the era of social media and videos when you, it's not like before when politicians will lie and uh they will say oh they don't have a video of me when i'm saying it all in days but now when it, whatever you said they will bring it to you all this is that you yeah. are analyzing now someone will be shocked where he be, he talk from when he see it You'll be asking yourself, hi, I messed up here, but he cannot come out and say it. This is someone who told you that Nelly is you know, he was, I know he was in this uh, comment section where I was, when I was playing that video, I saw somebody who came and held him. Immediately, that person asked him, Simon, help us. So uh, he asked him, um, Simon, so you are here, you know. And uh, the next thing he said is that uh, he's getting ready for another uh, broadcast. You know, the person now said to, to him, thank you, si Simon, you are doing well. From there, he disappeared. Of course, because uh, <laughs> many people know him with, with his corny way. With his fake know, account. Uh, with his fake account. Yes, but little did he know that uh, uh, he did not know that many people know him. We know yeah. him. Uh -huh. So that he, he can keep... Pro Samaneba, he thinks Samaneba doesn't go to one platform to another. He will come and say, oh, I don't want to. You think Samaneba doesn't go to one platform to another? You think so? If anybody he, thinks he's so, this so platform with something called Tanka. Tanka. Yeah. Uh, he stopped commenting after one of his. Uh, they hailed him. He yeah. stopped commenting. You think you think uh, he doesn't go to platform to platform? You know, some of our gullible, useless people, they will say, hey, he doesn't have that time. Samaneba visited every platform to every platform, but he, he, he will come out and pretend that he, he doesn't. Yes, he listened yeah. to he, all those messages. He listened to everything. That's Samanepa, why he lied and said that if you can show him where that he never saw a video where Nelly say uh, um the Biafra is dead. I, that he never saw the video. <laughs> Masi. That's this what I was goes. trying to do yesterday before I got caught up with the broadcast uh, of the yeah, DOS. Well, but I'm yes, going I, to continue it maybe tomorrow. Yes. We are need we need to be playing all his video and be showing him in his face because we don't carry propaganda. From what yeah. comes out from your mouth is what we are going to use to judge you. From all the things yeah. he has been saying. How can this guy come out and tell you I am Nelly? Nelly is me. And he Imagine, came out to I, deny and then and now he says that he never saw a video where Nelly made when uh, he is Nelly. Uh, could you imagine? You know, <laughs> I, I, sometimes I keep asking my, I keep wondering, say, oh, no wonder Fulani is uh, killing these so called Nigerians, so called useless, because they don't think. It's like, uh, should I say, it's like Britain created that place and spray something that will make everybody lose their senses. And Fulani, I beko Brunama, in a Irina, Tapia, now Bopia. Then they lose all their medulla of blagata. Thank God that we yeah. ban this 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 number, so that our people will recall. And there's something I need to I need to I need to say. One thing again I need to say is that uh, you see, Mazi, religion me kuraiaro in a way. Religion, because religion is not in a way. Religion killed us. Religion placed us in the predicament. Is it not the reason why all these fake pastors? Are backing him up, and uh, and it's because of this religion uh, bondage we are into. That's why we 
when we see that pastors are backing him up, we will say, yeah, he's the one doing it right. You know, the, the West are used pastor. Have you seen that one that call himself Ego Prophet again? Since we chase him in and tell him no one knows. Oh, the, Igu, the one, say, oh, the, the one, oh, that one, I, ha I never had time for that. The that one that came and said, hey, uh, there is no IPOB in London. There is no IPOB in Germany. There is no IPOB no, in... Uh, yeah, I know that, that one who always shows off his watch. This, uh, this and that geja, aga, aga, aga. These people, I want that geja, pasha shaja na on our land. I am telling you, I know you see some of that about and Nelly. Nelly, we will vanish his as his his family from Biafra land. You know when we speak it, people think. Ndage, me kwenye ni. I am a chani a teacher. They know these people. Some of that about Nelly have, we have, uh, you know, they have committed a lot of atrocity. Masi, believe you me, if not because of China's uh, and we don't want to tell our people what these people committed, the US don't want to tell you people. If you hear the atrocity these people have committed in our land, all oh, this one is just a minor, minor case. Of course. The, the main it's atrocity true. is being kept for Masi to see for himself. Yes. I am telling you, this Amanet, I want to know. This Amanet, this Amanet, I want to I cost his generation anywhere he come from. I cost I cost his generation. Samaneba is not uh, deadly like us. He just have or he just stay in one room. Me here, I'm more de I'm deadly more than him. More deadly. I don't serve. I don't serve. Uh, uh, I am not a Christian. I serve Lucifer himself. That is what they know me of. Lucifer himself, because. I wanted my people to be free. I have seen something that make me to hate Nigeria. Nigeria is not for us. Nigeria is there. Do you know the reason why it's feel like it's difficult for Nigeria to divide? You know the reason why? No. The reason why is this. Because Igbo man have went every part of Nigeria and invest money and invest billions, trillions of, of, of dollars, pounds and naira. Yeah. The, the Africans have, you know, invested everywhere. So we it's like we are losing. Anywhere there is a riot, Igbo man property must be destroyed. Anywhere in the part of Nigeria, anywhere at all, anywhere, all the whole 36 state of Nigeria, anywhere, anything occur, Igbo man must suffer it. That is why you see Fulanis. They have nothing to lose. Because I, 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 uh, uh, they have nothing when to do. When they come to your land, they stay in the bush. They don't do anything. They don't co contribute to the economy. Nothing. Yes. They know that if they cause mayhem in, in, in Biafra land, it's we are going to lose. They run to the north because they know that if our people in the north will not cause mayhem. They cause mayhem in the north. It's still our people that are going to lose. So it's like we are losing everywhere. They come to south. They cause mayhem. It's still our people that are going to lose. They come in uh, middle bed. They cost. Uh, you see, we are we are on earth. Can you know going to find a Biafra doing his business? We are everywhere. So we are the one suffering it. We are the one bearing the brunt. We are the one taking the bullet of other people. And that is why he feel like we are the one losing anywhere because Fulani can destroy anywhere in the south. They have nothing to to. They don't have anything. Oh, this their man. They can use through bush and go home overnight. Exactly. They they they, they can destroy everything in, in Biafra because they have nothing. They have nothing there yeah? because if these people develop uh, the way we develop everywhere, they have. You think if the Fulanis, the Northerners, have business that want to build us in Biafra land, do you think? They, they will start any little thing. They will burn our people's uh, shop, do everything. No, because it will affect them. But it's we that develop everywhere. That is why I think of, when I think of it, I say, everywhere. Anywhere. Even when... Okay, it does not matter the loss. There is a something you, you must remove from a meat to, to consume a meat. Uh, that is the thing we are removing now, Masi. And that is why what we are telling our people. That your property in anywhere in the zoo cannot stop the coming of Biafra. Either you allow Biafra to come or you lose it. And let me let me tell them, is is for your own benefit that Biafra come, your property will be saved. Because 
it will be an, a, another ECOWAS country. If any government yeah. destroy your property, the government of Biafra will go, we sue them and they will pay it. But right now, one danger we can go and destroy your property. It's one Nigeria. There is nothing you can say. They can go and bulldoze your market. It's one Nigeria. Do you think? Yeah. Do you think uh, if, if we have our own our own uh, government that these people will just go and burn the the market without the government of Biafra suing them? There is international treaty. There is international law, and still there is a uh, ECOWAS law. You can destroy. It was to have business in Ghana. The reason why yeah. they are treating us this way everywhere is because they know we, I was here, we don't have no home. We don't have nobody mm. looking after us. It's only we that look after ourselves. Because if we have government, do you think that, uh, let me put it this way, do you think as America now, eh, uh, like say, let's say America has business somewhere in Dubai or somewhere in any country where they know America, you know, do their business and you go and destroy it. Do you think American government will keep quiet? No, they will give, they will investigate and give you bill, and then you pay their citizens because they have government. But right now we don't have government because if they destroy your market in anywhere in the country, eh, what they will do it? Eh, the zoo media will never put it in a way where it will, it, it, it will say, "Oh no, this is not fair." How much? They will even come against you because True. we don't have no home. We don't have no government. You think that is why I say to our people, your property is secure in Nigeria if we stay on our own. Because if they destroy your property, we our government goes after them. They will pay it, and they cannot be killing Igbo people anyhow in Nigeria. No, you can't be killing our people anyhow. Have you ever seen an Israel uh, uh, citizen be killed in Taiwan or Japan or anyhow? No, you kill any Israel citizen in any country. Their, their government will ask questions. They will go for it. It's they will true. ask question. They will summon your embassy. And if you don't give them any good uh, uh, any good reason, they will assassinate your own uh, own citizen in any way or the other. They will do it. Have you ever heard uh, any Israeli citizen was killed somewhere? No. You can't, you can't do that. You remember uh, uh, one time that uh, they said that they, uh, they arrested an Israeli citizen that came to bring uh, that um, yes, something? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, they keep them. Zoo Around August. Yes. Zoo government just want to play hanky They just want to play as if they're tough. It's just one call from Israeli government. See, listen, don't allow these guys to be touched. You can just do as if we, we know what you are playing to do, like you are tough. But those guys will not be harmed. Because they know if those that citizens of Israel is see is being harmed, they know the consequences. They know. Yeah. Do you think they don't know? Israel know what to do. Israel have suffered the way we are suffering now, trying to gather our people. You think is Biafra or Israel will allow you to kill any of their citizens like that and go free anymore? No. You think is Biafra come? You can just come out. You can just wake up and go and kill any Igbo man anywhere in the world, anywhere in Africa or anywhere in the world. You can't do that anymore. The Igbo people have, their friends have home. They have somebody who will look after them. Not all these full and after the genocide, they put on Haneze, they put Igbo World Congress, they put Igbo Kulie, Aki Kenga. All these people are a bunch of criminals that were supposed to be wiped out, wiped out in Biafra land. These are a bunch of full and uh, slaves. Remember they when they create these things, when they create these things, there is a interest, there is a leverage. So there is what is their job to sabotage what if any one way or the other in order exactly. to be to promote yes. full and his agenda. Exactly. Yeah, but for now, I will be on the background. I will be on the background. So Mazi, do you see do you see that uh, uh, what happened in uh, uh war in on those states? Uh mm -hmm. is calling Amateku to to repair to stand up for their right to you know to you know checkmate full and to stand up and do their job to do you know they were speaking hard oh and they said this but, they stupid don't all our people. Uh, but are their own people our own people that full and has been killing the uh esm is there they never said esm do your job 
because when when they speak, Fulani will be uh, they cannot no, speak. This type, of, this type of people call our Haneze, they don't need people who will do a diligent job or committed. They just want people that they can use, like the one Simon and Nelly is creating. A uh, highest bidder gets it all. That's exactly. the type of people. Uh, this type of people want to work with. They don't want devotees. Continue. I will be at the background. I want to do one or two quickly. Okay. If okay. Uh, just in case, if we see or somebody join us, I know it's old program. But we can stay. You know, it's still fresh. And then uh, yes, we we'll bring them in. because you know that um, this Ohanes and Doshin and Dam. These are bunch of. These are a bunch of hyenas. They are sending messages to Amoteku. They cannot even mention ESN in their mouth. Said, ah, ESN is uh, protecting our, our own our own bush. They have seen what is about to come. They have seen the the uh, pastor they kidnapped. He made it clear there that these people want to. Uh, they said that Nigeria belongs to them. They are everywhere in our bush. That's that that uh, expose that man said did not consign them. All. They did not even come and say something. But look at the uh, uh, the one that happened in Yoruba land. That is one they will come out and be saying, uh, talking about a coup to stand up to take their distance. You know, talking, talking hard. This one, they never would do one. They cannot. This one, they people would do it. This one, they need demand. Demand in our land because. How can how can you have somebody like Niyangwodo who went for who went to bow for Tumbu to make him governor of Enugu State? How can this somebody protect you? How can somebody like uh, Niyangwodo who went to Sokoto and tell uh, Fulani before you kill any Fulani, he first of all kill it John Niyangwodo? How can this person speak for you? How? I, I ask you, uh, Biafra Sanindibo, how? It's only in Dibu. We are just scattering on our own. We don't have nobody that speaks for us apart from us in them. We are and we say we have elite, we have elders. Believe you me, if not because of uh, if not because of uh, I don't know how Mazi don't want IPOB to go violent. Nah, I know this people a goji but jumbas. I'm telling you, these people need to be wiped away in Biafra land. These are we need to. I need to do one dog or rock like this. Check a or rock. These are not our people. People who went to Obi and be uh, weekend and be singing for weekend, weekend. I guess so. Money, somebody that committed genocide against your own people, against your own people. You went and be singing. Do you think if we can, can we can kill the people, uh, people uh, of, uh, of the Yoruba in, in, in River State and uh, affair the fair? And their governors will go to be singing for him. There will someone him and asking question. If not, is she a, is she a ben, yeah? But uh, look at how the just just because they want IPOB dead. That was the reason. You know, they want they want to see IPOB not to exist anymore. Imagine without IPOB in Biafra land now, what is going to be our fate? Imagine. Imagine if there is no ESN in Biafra land. What just check what is happening now? What is going to be our fate? Biafrans, judge by yourself. Ju ju just judge by yourself. Imagine there is no IPOB, there is no Mazin Namdekan, there is no ESN. Can you go with Uno? You watch this, these governors and these traditional rulers and PG and the uh, governors watch you people slaughtered in your farm. Butchered you, rape you in your farm. None of them can say something. That one, uh, that one, you na na Nenugu house. Come and say, in your bro no no He came out and asked you people to be praying. Pray for who? The people that came to kill you. A butcher no You know, Emma, Sometime, eh? Sometime. These people think we are stupid. They think because they are governors, they are untouchable. They are, you know, they can deceive our people. Nothing will happen. You know, just let's impoverish them. Let's keep. Can I make another thing crazy? But the deadline is coming. One day, I got to talk with Jesse. One day, I got to talk with Jesse. These people, I asked them, go and watch the video of Samedo. 
Go and watch the video. All these politicians go and sit down and watch the video of Samedo when he was captured and the way they treated him. Go and watch the the, the video of Samedo. And you will know that the you will have the same the same the same way Samedo was treated is the same way we will treat you people when the time comes. You can kill us, you can bring your danger with military, but one day uh, those military, uh, if they ask them to come to Biafra and Haga Shemba, believe you me. I think you people have been deceiving our people now with the PVC. This PVC now is the last bus stop. When they humiliate you people or finish, look at RFI's son that was supposed to be a house cleaner for an Igbo man today, if not because of uh, uh, Fedruga the Amagametos. This bunch of criminal Britain Amagametos with this with this uh, useless Ndenangufra de Nun. People that use cow dump to, to, to wash their body. People that use cow piece to bath. Is there. I'm not making it up. It's there. You can see them, Mr. Hell. These are their knowledge. They are magametos with them. Now they feel that they can control it, uh, whatever in Biafra land. Are you not ashamed that Alamajri is controlling you? And and uh, and he said that uh, Peter B, if Peter B become a president, call him a goat. That is what some uh, five son says. If Peter B become a president, do you should call him a goat. Nigeria should call him a goat because they know that they cannot, there is no how P2B will become president. They know. Even though if he's win, even though they declare P2B win today, they are still going to, not going to give him. They will do him what they do to Abiola. The same thing, this Trumbo that is jumping up and down, the same fate awaiting them. But uh, I ask this so-called Nigerians, why is to, uh, Fulani that, that is not up to 3% in Nigeria automating you guys? You can't stand up we can't team up and stand up and say enough is enough. Remember, it's only it's only Biafra and Sibo people that fight Nigeria for good three years. Not fight the Western world. I say Nigeria because if it's Nigeria, we could have wiped them out a long time. The Western world, America, Britain, Russia, and the uh, African countries, uh, and uh, some Middle Belt country, uh, name them. We fight the, for three good years. Imagine. Imagine if it's just we and Nigeria only. Nobody put hand. Imagine by now, everybody could have known peace could have been. Imagine, good three years. Do you know what it takes for, for a day to go by? For two days to go by? Three days to go by? And you get one week? And you get uh, a month? And you get uh, two months, three months? What was going on? War was still going on for three good years. We hold the, the Western world. We build our own, I mean, our own tanker. We build our own ammunition. We build our own obudigwe. We build our own bombs, rocket, everything on our own. Within the space of three, three, three good years, we build all those things. Imagine if we, if we stayed on our own. Imagine what we could have done. By now, we could have been compared with America with their own submarine. You see our own submarine, whatever they we we do it. They know they know all these things. They know all these things, but they don't want to let their friend go because they know who we are. But we are we we, we must surely go. Oh, you know what I will hear? Kelo, I can hear you one day. What I will hear? That is where we are go. We are heading to now. Uh, it pains me every day when I see a blood of their friend drop drop. You know, for for no reason, these people are keep massacring us you know, for no reason. And uh, you see, I I I watched in Sima the other day, uh, saying that uh, they are not Idu. That uh, I saw that small boy uh, saying that. Uh, let me educate in Sima a little bit. I know he's watching, or if he's not watching now, he's going to watch this program. You see, my, I saw you in one of your brokers. You were roaming around somewhere in Europe saying that uh, you have told your people back home, anybody that says Biafra, they will treat him like a criminal. They will do this. They will do that. Uh, if you do now, anybody that says, uh, now, you see, my, be ready to take responsibilities for anything you project. Anybody that, anybody that was killed, you know, 
be ready be to be ready to take responsibilities you know all the stupid things about you people you people don't know when you say all these things i keep asking don't you know that you have family you people don't know you have family or you don't know that we know all your families all these people that be sponsoring uh, Samurai and Nelly to be killing our people. Don't you know that we know where they come from? Don't you know that we have a we compile list? These people are my people. Who do you think IPOB is? Dumb people? You think we are dumb? At the proper right time, no These people, <laughs> Masi say, it's good you doubt us. The way Nigeria call us uh, Okada riders, uh, IPOB is uh, Okada riders, people say, uh, uh, they are Miss Grant, they are nobody. When the why we see the Suleiman, when the Suleiman start playing, then I know that uh, these people are not Okada people. These people are not Okada people as we thought we they are. Obasanjo himself confirm it. Now, are we Okada people again? Are we Miss Grant? No. Now they are talking about IPOB. How can we stop IPOB? The same way I am asking in Sima, take responsibility of what you ever you say on social media. Uh, uh, in uh, if you uh, anybody that says uh, about Biafra, Biafra is fraud in in uh, Aquaibon, in Cross River, in, in Southside, in this, they will treat him as a criminal. Okay, let's hear that we uh, any of Igbo man is, is being killed in Aquaibon because of your utterances. That time you will know that. Let me tell you people one thing. Igbo people, we are like a uh, hippotamus in the river. Hippotamus can never look for your trouble. We are hippotamus. We don't look, hippotamus will lie low in his water until you come to, you know, poke him. Then he will now show you that he can cut you off immediately. These are who we are because we don't go first to look for trouble until he poke us. When you poke us hard, you know, there is a limit you can push Igbo man. You push Igbo man. He doesn't want to care. He can. He will. He will. He's ready to die with you. And we are getting to that that extent. Everybody bleeds. Everybody bleeds. You know that. Go and told you people. Whatever that you are doing, do not allow Igbo man to touch gun. He, he said it. Do you think he just said it just to praise us? No. You see the little ones that is happening now, little criminals that some are, are flooding. You see, you see what they are, you see what they are causing. Imagine we send them to that these people are now. Uh, uh, some did not study his uh, criminality mind. Imagine you that in Europe saying that uh, you are you do anybody that if we send some of these boys to uh, 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 your village in, in in less than 10 minutes don't you know that is you don't know that go and read the, the history of people. we never conquer anybody it's not in our dna and we never we don't conquer people and people never conquer us go and ask british we don't conquer people and it's not in our dna and nobody has conquered us before that is why you see the fulanese are fighting us hard because they know let me educate you, you fool in Sima, because you are in Britain eating eating uh, British uh, full breakfast, monkey. You don't know where uh, where you came from. Don't you know? You don't know where you came from. You don't know. Go and ask Britain. Did they have we conquered anybody before? The answer is no. Have they conquered us before? Have we con in the history? Did they conquer us? No. Have we conquered everybody before? The answer is no. So who are you to threaten Igbo people? If you go to social media, everything happens. Yeah, he was uh, this. He was pre uh, president. Uh, this. He was uh, this. He was uh, there. He was uh, since 2015. Eh? What you will hear? Ah, he was uh, this. He was uh, that. He was uh, this. They are painting you people black in social media in front of the world. And you cowards, some cowards Igbo people, Appraising them, you are come out and been destroy your own people. You don't know that they are channeling this thing to destroy you. A full of food now, my here in Sima Nata Goro will come out on social media and up on the one on, and you are you are clapping for him. Eh, wow, bomb nearing Keta who did not know who his father is. He will come out and broken on you. Don't you know that evil people are hot cake? 
go to Nigeria, go and ask them. If Igbo man did not bring a common common toothpick, they will never clean their teeth. If Igbo man did not bring television, they will never watch TV. Oh, what about a uh, tire? They will never, their motor will pack the, the heaven knows. Uh, what about uh, the clothes? Uh oh. What? Tell me. What about, what about, what about a uh, 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 fridge? They will never have fridge. All those things, we never, we don't need to import them. If Nigeria leave us alone in Aba, we will manufacture all those things. Life is it's a gift from Chuko Kabiama. You can't take you can't jealous people that God have blessed. Despite that we have a flavor that is selling us up. How many population are Israel today? But you cannot play, penetrate them. You see the last war Israel fought with the with the Palestinians. You see small tiny Israel. Can you beat them? You see how they we are using iron drone to intercept every missile that Hamas throws to them. Eh? Upon it, 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 it was it's in record. Was it uh, either nearly two thousand rockets was uh, uh, you know was thrown at Israel? Iron drone was intercepting it. Do you think Biafra cannot manufacture those things? You think we cannot? Man These are gifts. God have God have the people uh, uh, every every individual in this world every people in this world God created there is a gift he gives to them why do you think why do you think the whole Europe today Russia is supplying them gas only Russia supplying them gas because Tuko Kikabiama is not stupid he kept that he kept he give Russia those quantity of gas and and crude oil for some reason because they know that you know that if this person have this person have this person have Russia will not become who they are today. Don't you know? Don't you know that uh, they will take them, uh, take them, wipe them out very easily. Don't you know? But ask yourself, why is it that it's only them to go and give that res uh, 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 resources? There is a reason. You can't jealous the people that God have blessed. Understand it in your score. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a gift. It's not by our power. It's not we make it. It's not by our power. If it is by our power, see, you will see an Igbo man. Uh, 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 we come to any part of uh, the zoo. He will, he will, he will take a small shop and start sending chingoma and sweet. Before you know it, he has another shop. Before you know it, he goes to village and carry somebody. And put in the other shop and be managing that. But before you know it, you become a billionaire. These are uh, God given uh, uh, blessing. It's not by our making. Stop jealousy, Igbo people. The jealous of Igbo people are the reason why Fulani are killing you people. We are the ones stopping Fulani for you people because they want to see if they can subdue us. If they subdue Igbo people, this your Niger data are uh, just my mind for them. Don't you know? Don't you know that this Niger data, we are the ones saving you people. Don't you know? Chineke one no akodia. More people. Don't you know that you people is just one full animal will just come there and ch chase all of you? You don't know? I watch them all the time. Ibo, 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 this. Ibo, Ibo, sa wicked. Ibo, sa okay, Ibo, sa. If social media did not come out to you, you people will still believe that we are, we are in a war work. Isn't it? But now that money rituals, we have seen it all over the Nigeria. We know who people that did it most. Eh? My people everywhere. The envy and jealous of Igbo man is the calamity that is before you people in Nigeria. You don't know it. it don't, don't you know? We will die, yes. You people too will die. Because you think your envy, we have developed everywhere. So we cannot live with impoverished us. You people use Igbo people to be playing game. You know, let's use them be playing game. Let's use them be playing game. Uh, because we are if uh, we dev if we did not have market everywhere, you will see this Nigeria will be coming. No people, no ethnic group will agree to kill their own. No, because I this in the Igbo. Igbo people is uh, people taking bullets for all of you. I know all these things. Listen, the person that is speaking. My name is C2. There is a reason why they call me C2. I'm very intelligent human being. I know all these things that is happening. Eh? I know all these things. 
that is happening. We, I know what is happening. Yeah, I know. Sometimes I don't blame Maz, uh, people that call Mazin Namdekano to take five state. I don't blame. I don't blame them. Sometimes, let me tell you, we can, we can. Let's part that uh, Nigeria, uh, Gowan and the Sobasan, they, they divide us. We are one people, yes, but they divide us. Cut away our see something. They say that uh, we are not. Uh, look at your uh, old people. And we can is now bribing our people uh, in, that, in that that area to join uh, River State, so that our people now will be fighting themselves. They are not tomorrow. They will say these people are uh, emo before, but they join. We can is bribing them. They stagnate us so that we have a shore uh, of sea. But we are one people. They divide us. That is why I see some of them answering Jack uh, Jack Robinson English in them. These are Igbo people because they tell them uh, change your names. Full, I need tell you to change your names. You change your name, Jack Robinson. Uh, uh, you see somebody answering. Where is that one? Answering. Uh, what is one idiot? His name is uh, Timmy Preva. I hope you both. These are uh, answer your native name. No. Car wars everywhere. You think we are stupid? We are not stupid. We know everything that is happening. We know. We are very intelligent. We know. It's just that we don't want Polani to penetrate our 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 territory. But you people are bringing them more more. Asadi Dukubo is there with his twenty one uh, pigs talking rubbish all the time, thinking that Fulani will spare him if they came with their jihadists. They will spare. You think they will spare you? You think they will spare you? Full of the kill Gulat in uh, Imo State just to make, uh, create a point. Don't you know that they, they are the ones that kill Gulat? They are own, they sacrifice Gulat just to get point to come and kill our people. You see how they roll? We know all these things. We know, we know all these things. You know? We know all these things. You think if we have stay our own, Fulani or any ethnic group, we can't kill any woman. I bet you, we, it take us 10 years, we beat one atomic bomb that if you the top rubbish we throw it i got we are everywhere you run this is who we are we don't look for trouble but don't look for our trouble god have blessed us have put everything we need to get in our brain that is why we say we don't need this oil and gas take it and we want to be free believe you me we want to be free gas and oil is rubbish it's absolutely rubbish. In the next 30 years now, there will be nothing like oil and gas again. The world have... Look at... Can you believe... Look at Dubai. Go and check the, the map of Dubai. And, 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 go and look at Dubai uh, 20 years ago or 30 years ago and look at Dubai now. Eh? Where people can stay and beat skyscraper of, uh, of, uh, of, of, of 50, 100 skyscraper. Eh? Imagine if we stay on our own, what we are going to do. You think uh, we are the ones dying for, for you people? Our riverland brothers and sisters, we we are the ones dying for you people. We are the ones stopping Fulanese. And you know this. You just don't want to tell yourself the truth. You know me. See, to I speak the truth and I speak the truth and damn the consequences. It's the truth. It's not true. I'm not making it up. It's the truth. Because we have we share we are brothers and sisters. When Fulani penetrate us, you people are just my mind. And you know it. Stop deceiving yourself, oh. Stop saying Igbo man, Igbo, Igbo man, yeah, yeah, yeah. You people are uh, dancing in your grave, calling Igbo man, Igbo man, Igbo man. You think you are going to finish Igbo man? We are in millions. You can only ask no okay, you okay that I just magic gare. Eh, Mexicali, you can keep since since night since uh, after the genocide. Uh, well, have we finished? I have well, like now, June. Eh, well, have we finished? You can kill us, you can humiliate because I know you love to see woman in his poor blood. You, you, you sweet, all of you, one at one or two, but we know our problem. Our problem is these politicians in our land, people like a one with them, out of all these people. When we when our youth we are calling our youth to raise up, wipe them out. This one is not hey, I'm from Enugu, I'm from Abakleka, uh, I'm from Imo, I'm from uh, how can you keep a brother? These are the these are the demons. You have to be like demon to fight the demon. You don't need to carry Bible to fight the demon. No, that's a crime. And let me tell you something. 
if you die, any of your people that die and they bury it in the name of Jesus Christ, he's going to have fire. You don't you know? You are worshipping a, a white man God. A white man God. That is who Jesus Christ is. Don't you know? I tell my people from now, I will start the campaign. If anybody, you lost your, uh, your family member or something, you call any pastor to come and bury him in the name of Jesus. Don't you know that if Jesus Christ is a crime? You know, don't you know? Mad people everywhere. We will chase all this rubbish in our land. These are evil uh, uh, the Europeans, Britain, uh, come and put for us to deceive, to deceive our people. Somebody that he go and call Father in the name of Father, uh, Sons and the Holy Spirit, uh, Jesus Christ. We we'll speak the truth and damn the consequences. That is the truth. It doesn't matter who 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 is who he affected. If he affect you in any minute, that is the truth. And because of the truth, that is where that is how we are going to free ourselves. It doesn't matter. Religion is a fraud. It's a it's a taboo. We have to go back to who we are. We have to go back to our religion. Our ancestors, our our forefathers come out in the morning, they wash their hand, they they come out and bring the collar. They they call our gods, they break it, they chew it and put for them there. Those those days when there is a you commit a crime, all those things is what uh, the Bible wanted to destroy in our land. Is the truth. I am not making it up. Before, before, we met all our troubles. These are our ancient people. I wouldn't know this is how it, how it works. But now, somebody will stay in one place and tell you that uh, your, that tree in your company is what to hold your, your future. You go and take it down. And you don't know what that, that tree stands for. Don't you know that everything has has something that uh, uh, they preside it for? Go to go to India. Do you know that uh, India don't eat some part of India they don't eat cow. India don't eat cow. They worship cows. Don't you know? Don't you know? George Money, can you hear me? Master George, I I can you hear me? Marcy George, um, you're not here at the moment. Um, I think you are still busy. I will leave it here and call it a day and then let's uh, you know convey another day and then you know I'm gonna go and do something else. At least I've spoken in a lens where people can understand. Uh everything. You know? If our people doesn't want to wake up, that is their own entire business. Ma, as you said, that is your own entire business. If you want to remain dumb, all grown, Anna here, Kuliana, Ocean, and Nanti Kebe, Faye Sheba, Po, Onana Hano. What someone ever can do in our land, just to he wants to become a king. Opatayo, Ule, Shani, and Ned, and Ime, or Tanja, Ule, Purinishi, Patana, social media, Korobish, Nelsi, Lemonkia. He thinks he can. He can come and uh, threaten IPOB. Nah, you know. IPOB that uh, Polish Chirenga. Nah, just for the proper time of the whistle. Look, who is our neighbor? You think you can come at him because you come closer to Mazen and can intervene. Then you will come and be challenging IPOB, calling DOS criminal, saying everybody should stop going to meet him. And you say, yeah, Mazen and the kind of disciple. Everybody should not contribute in IPOB. And the, our people, I cannot read the handwriting on the wall. Eh? He shouldn't contribute to the IPOB. And who, I, if I may ask, some, who are you? Now, people may say, if he's nobody, why is he he's, he's talking? He's only talking in social media. Let him come, come on the ground. Let him move out. We can't listen to move out. Move out from that Finland. He should move out and go to that Europe country. That bastard. If you look, it's nobody. This guy is nobody. He's just making empty noise in social media. Now, nah, nice. what he's sharing now, we need. Try to lie to lie to you people that now 
Dibia, uh, one Dibia, uh, you know, shy renewed. Lie upon lie. This idiot. I keep asking people. Does he mean that the people that is following someone are not proper Igbo people? These are the people that want to destroy IPOB. These people are people that hate mass, and especially these Bini people. We know you people. IPOB are, are very intelligent. We know all these things. Our own people, we deal with them when they write and come, and they know it. We, they will never come to Biafra land. All of you that hijack IPOB money, ESM money, all of you in America that uh, that uh, are sponsoring the killing of Biafrans, which is America and Nelly and all, time is fast approaching. I want you people to doubt us. The same way Nigeria doubt us. I give you why, at the end of the day, I got Horela for At the end of the day, all of you, that come out in, uh, with Uma Adaka, Uma Ada, these bastards now, homeless people, Monahawa, all of you that come to social media, we know you people. Time is fast approaching. He's coming. Do you think Mazen Namrikan will be suffering D uh, DSS dungeon and you people will be making mockery of him? Samanap and and all of you, Uma, you think you'll be making mockery of Mazen Namrikan? <laughs> now, these people. Aguni ye she lelen no kwana boni do ona ye aguni aguni ye she lelen no na bo time is coming. I want you the way you are doubt, you know. We not everything we tell you people. I got want to know one by one. Chine ka one knock. Mazi, thank you very much for giving me this opportunity. And then I will leave it here. Thank you very much.